recap here. Sorry. What do we got? We got everybody at two hero points because we're on webcam, right? Yes. Mm hmm. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think so. I think we got a couple missile. Joy, oh, Graham, Graham. Yeah. Sorry. Yes, sorry. Webcam. Jeez. Get on. And then. Yeah, but he's not added the points. He sneezed your lose, you know. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I I've done it. Well, I, oh, it's the I, Europeans I, again. I see what's happening. Okay. Yeah. Dos hero points. And who was paying attention last week? It's a really tough question, I know. None of us, I don't. How about you, I mean, Troy? How about, how about you? Uh, thank you. That's See? That's the attitude I want to hear. You know what, I Chad? I it three times. Give it, come on. I was bit, I'm not going to jump into this. <laughs> Chad, because you you recommended that all of us were paying attention, I'm going to ask you to do a recap for a third okay. hero point. Okay. So, last week, I have to separate my session from your session. <laughs> um, we uh, definitely, we got done, um, we woke up from our long rest from fighting Kanipo, because that was just a an abysmal fight. Fun, but terrible. Um, and we uh, went back through, we kind of fast-tracked back through the um, the stump there after we found the gate key, and uh, it was pulling us toward a, a specific um, direction. And we followed it, and we went to a single gate that was active and after some hemming and hawing we kind of uh decided you know what we're gonna just go ahead and go go through it so we did and we're like okay where where are we we have no idea we went through a jungle for a little while we saw a, a city on a cliff and uh, a, a gondola we made our way that that way we bypassed a fight with some uh spooky looking giants because we kind of ran through it and as we were riding the gondola toward the city, uh, they were speaking some strange language. And then finally, somebody ran forward and said, hey, welcome. And they pointed to the sky and they're like, you're from over there. And we're like, what? Mm -hmm. And so we, uh, we uh, discovered we are actually on a different planet. Uh, going to add that hero point. L. Ellie, the lady who... Yes, yes. Oh, don't look at me like that. You are in Castrovel, the home of the elves. Has has our gondola gotten there? You guys have arrived. You're at the city. All right. You guys are with the crowd. We there's a lot it. of there's a lot of elves just staring at you, waving. Some of them. But yeah, I'm gonna slowly take one step out of the gondola and say, "One small step for you, man." One giant leap for humankind. Um, can I add a villain point? No, okay. No. All right, all right. All right. I don't know what to, it's a it bigger a step joke. for us gnomes. Oh, let me try and get out of this thing. And like, Onovan's gonna try and like slowly sidestep, you know, pretty scared of the, the drop still. You probably should hurry as the gondola keeps moving, guys. You probably ah. should. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> So yeah. as Jordan steps off, he's kind of dumbstruck that there's so many elves here um, that he actually takes his wreath off his head that was hiding his his ears. <gasps> and Aww. the some of the elves look and they're like, "Oh, ears." Huh? It's kind of a show. They they look a little confused because you look human, but also elf, right? Mm -hmm. mm. But they don't necessarily they don't have negative reactions if that helps. Yes, so. Aleli will step forward. Um, welcome, welcome to Castrovel. Uh, we're in the city of uh, Lusk. Lusk. Oh shit, Lusk. Ah, uh, this is city, city name Lusk. L I'm gonna type it, and you guys can help me pronounce it as well. Luskilawa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sounds Hawaiian. Luskialua. Luskialua. It's good with the accent. Welcome to Loskia Lua. Um, well, it says Loxia Lua. Is it? Did I misspell that? It's L O S K. I typed okay. it manually. Yes. Um, 
What? Why are you here? We um, don't know. That's a real good question, ma'am. <laughs> We're sort of hoping to find out here, to be honest with you. Oh, that would be magnificent. Genthiel, a elf in the back who's got... By the way, the... What he's got in this head is just decorative, like, he doesn't actually have a third eye. And also, mm -hmm. I'll show you uh, LLE's full picture as well. Here. Gosh, look at that five head. <laughs> ah, he well, looks like a standard villain. Uh, you are our <laughs> guests, as long, as long as you are here, says Gentile. Please, uh, would you like to accompany us? Um, oh, he he says something in a foreign language. He's Karafushuta. Yes, we'll get your uh, housing arrangements too. Uh, we want to be considered bad hosts. Uh, yes, of course, of course. Um, yes, please come tell us your story as they lead you through some um, definitely odd architecture, city streets, but elvish in design. You, if you guys do follow, yes. Are you not the only um, like city around here? We've not seen any other life. Well, not uh, you know humanoid life for some time. Oh, there are more cities in Castrovel, here and there, near and Is Castrovel the name of this, this country or this region or something? Is this planet, is this planet, is literally the planet Castrovel, but obviously, oh. you know, considering... Um, well, we're from uh, Gal Galerian. I know, I can tell. Huh. Your How mannerism, you know? your clothes. In fact, How I, do you know? a, I recently had made a friend in Galerian, um, oh? she says. Yes, Ooh. she's. What's the name uh, of this friend? Ooh. She, well, uh, last week, while working on our observatory, our main observatory, I received a message from a young human oracle named Sakuachi, who was sending a message from a city in Golarion called Skywatch. She stumbled into a no, magic. I've never heard of it. I don't know much about Skywatch myself, but she says she stumbled onto a magical telescope in Skywatch Observatory, and she somehow managed to transmit her message to our own observatory in Los Kialua. I what I'm going to spend some time investigating that message in hope of reverse engineering it. I'm assuming, she turns around, you want to go home? You don't want to be stuck in this planet, yes? <laughs> Patriarchy. Uh, job ahead of, ahead of her. I'm fully in support of your mission. Well, as she leads you to, like, she'll lead you to what would be your residence. It's like a Airbnb, for lack of a better word, right? You get your own rooms and you get like a little bit of a living room. As she'll sit you down, Genthiel will also sit down. There's a couple of elves outside and they're just kind of wandering around, like trying to get you some definitely exotic food and whatnot. Um, uh, uh, etc. As they ask you, what? So please explain. Uh, actually, Genthiel will ask you, would you be so kind to explain now how you ended up here? There was a uh, big uh, portal. Uh, we've been, well, I, I guess we've been traveling for a long time through several portal looking things, and uh, we found one. That led us uh, here. You recently. you walk through a portal, an aduara, awidara, but th aren't they closed without a key? Uh, yes, uh, we were in a region. I think it was the first world. Okay. And uh, we found. I think we found the key there. Yeah, we did. Uh, uh, wait, 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 no, before how, we go any further, no, 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 key? don't, don't, don't worry about that. No, I, I think they misspoke a sec. I just, what, um, what is it you do here with all your Telescopes and stuff. Go to me a diplomacy check or deception, Anavan. Um, okay. I guess I won't show the key. Mm -hmm. I was uh, going to show it off and they'd be all impressed with us, but no. She looks <laughs> impressed when you mention the key, but Anavan quickly. Oh. oh. Okay. <sighs> Anavan, um, LL is really excited. I, I haven't seen a, a gate key in the longest time. 
Um, oh, uh, what I do here, I am a bit of researcher. I study in the telescope. Um, she'll, like, kind of start um, side, like, it's a side conversation. She's going to start explaining what she does, but she will ask um, Grim. You can. She'll ask Grim, uh, roll me secret perception. Uh, can I see the key? I'm really excited to see one up close. Is she, like, Is the, are these her true intentions? She's genuinely excited to see, like, an actual gate key. Um, she also, um, she doesn't seem to have, like, any secret intentions. She okay, seems like a, so. yeah, she seems like a cute, a cute little, she's small. What, what, uh, what, what do you know about these, uh, these gates? Oh, the Audara. Um. All right, so you got the same name that we do for them. Mm -hmm. They are, and, I mean, she'll give you the information. I'll give you the start of the module. I will look it up and give it to you again, because I don't mind. Wait, what? Why? Okay, great. Sorry, guys. Um, they're an ancient network of magical portals, sometimes crudely referred to as elf gates. They take the stone of torn arches, each activated by a specific magical key that open the portals to a link gate somewhere else in the material place. Many Odara and their keys have been lost, which is why it's so exciting to finally see an actual key. Um. Have you not heard of one being activated, you know, before or recently or anything? Not any people, you know, coming out of them or going into them? That is strange. No, we had nobody here in Cast... Uh, uh, sorry, I guess I jumped a little forward. But he, he like, he listens. Genthia will be like, yeah, that's... No, they do not activate by themselves. Why? Uh, well... All right, well, yes, go on. I'll, I'll show the key. She'll reach out. Can I see it? Uh, I'll look to I'll look to the rest and see what they. Are you guys like nodding or? Yeah, nodding we're... shrugs. Well, nodding. Okay. They seem to be very hospitable. So. Ella looks really That's excited bad. to finally see a key. Um. Do you have it, her? Yeah, yeah. Ellie grabs the key, and immediately her skin begins to wither visibly. As she falls unconscious. Ah. What? As she screams. Ah. Well, uh, that didn't happen last time. I'll quickly snatch it and pocket it. What? What is? What is going on? Aleli? Aleli? Genthiel will just oh, start no. shaking her. Uh, can so, I go over and try and help her? Did you, I kill her? You can roll me medicine check on Uh I'm going to actually. Actually, no. Uh, I was just going to cast heal if I can. Okay. You run up and two action, one action, three action. Yeah, two action, yeah. Heal Aleli as she doesn't respond. Her skin withering darker and darker and darker. What the hell? Says Genthiel, just standing up. What? This this was not our intention. We we didn't know this would happen. What is... We don't know what's going on. What? The... Um... I, I don't understand. We, we've touched it. Uh, yes. Oh, I've got a real uh, bad idea. Oh, wait, no, the Gumblet curse. Yeah? Shit. Oh, the we curse. Thought of that. What, wait, is, what, Jardin, is, what is this? Jardin can all that what, find, what, right? what is this Umbilet curse? Uh, we heard that... there was a curse attached to the key, but uh, no, not what? Well, uh, attached to the... Uh, uh, Wait, Jardin, you, you, to the gates. you can hold it, right? Wait. I haven't tried to. Well, let's not try it right now, huh? No, um, but like... Okay, he looks confused. I... I. Okay. It's a curse. Quickly, try hold to remove on, it from on. her. Hold on, one does, second, Does anyone God. have the magic? All right, my sister's playing a prank on my dad or something. It's great. It's interrupting my work. Sorry. Um... The the <laughs> the uh, could you repeat that? I'm so sorry. Somebody said uh, somebody quick uh, remove the curse or something. I I don't know what to do. What, with this this ambulet, do, do you? Uh, where we come from, there is a city where um a, a man by the name of was it Kanipo who made the curse? Mm -hmm. It was right. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. A, uh, an ancient creature, he made a curse that would keep elves out of the region. Anybody and... can roll a DC 27 occultism. 
Arcana, I'm really good with or them. Medicine to try to figure out what this Ombivit curse uh, that is on Aleli is doing. I'm not good enough with Occultism to reach a 27, so... You can technically can, try it. You can certainly try I can do an Arcana. I'll try Occultism, I guess, but I doubt it'll... I'll, I doubt I'll roll that high. Huh. It's a really elves, high DC curse. Um, Gentheal looks very panicked. The elves are, like that are around are looking panicked. Um, unfortunately, uh, you don't seem to ascertain what the Ambulant Curse actually does. The only thing you see is Aleli right now is completely just unconscious. She seems to have, she seems to be kind of blackening and shriveling a rotting curse. And as Gentheal calls for some healers, um. I, I, just keep that key away from any of us, please. Do not let us... Yeah, I, I, I will keep it to myself, I swear. Uh, you have my word. I'm I, so sorry. We, we didn't know that this was going to happen. The, the, I, I, it's fine. I, I can see in your faces your genuine expression of shock. I don't yeah, I think you have shocked. bad intentions. Uh, healers, please. And a few healers would come up and just try it and try to roll their... You know, meta, meta wise, roll their own medicine and all that. As one of the healers was, well, she's, she's completely cursed. She's. <laughs> Guys, please, please. Um, she's going to. From what I can see, she's got six days. Well. Six days? Six days. In day four, she will lose her memory. In day five, she will lose all her memory. Oh, sorry. In day four, she will lose her most recent year of memory. Day five, she will lose the entirety of her memory. And then she will die on the sixth day. She looks oh. horrified as she says that. Have you oh, seen this okay. before? I have heard of curses like these afflicting elves. There is something interesting about this curse, though. I can sense a psychic imprint. Huh, says Sentiel. Interesting. He, like, closes his eyes and just kind of thinks. Oh, my lord. We... Yes. I've experienced a psychic imprint like this. The key. Put it on the table, please. Let me just look at it. Oh, hesitantly put it on the table. He like stares at it and casts a spell without touching it. <laughs> this is the imprint of Osoyo, the Black Frost Whale. There's whales here? Black Frost Whale? Yes, I will explain. My mother, Iskariel, may she rest in peace. Revealed it to me so that I should recognize it again if such a time should come. She was a renowned healer, also a part of a secret society. She was of a fellowship tasked with remembering the campaign against Osoyo. Of Osoyo, I know nothing, almost nothing, except that it was a grave threat, a danger so terrible that even the mere legend of it was passed down to only a few worthy scholars. You, that key right there, and in fact, all of you seem to have the imprint of a soyo. What happened in that moment? Oh my god. Is he talking about our marks? Yes. Damn. Uh, mo the, when all the gates on Galarian activated? That moment? That's what you mentioned earlier, yes. Yeah, we we alluded we to walked, it. Yeah, we all walked into these gates and came back without memory of what we had seen with the these marks. You I'll point to someone else's because I can't show my own. Have the imprint of Black Frost well on you. So does the key, and so uh, does. So what does that mean? I do not is know. That why? I I think Osoyo is somehow bound up in the key's curse, and I think the knowledge about it could be vital to maybe curing Aleli. Before it's too late. So, but this Osoyo is... Are they... Are they evil? I would ask that you go to the memory cache and talk to the remnants of my mother's memory. 
she will know all about the soyo and she can give oh, you all this information this memory cache it is a place where memories are stored then indeed this location here los kilawa the city is not only to watch the stars previous civilizations have come and gone in these mountains and deep beneath our streets lies a sacred, ancient site, a place where great scholars of the past were laid to rest. In this subterranean grove, the memories of the best and brightest are preserved and watched over by guardians known as Skullborn. They keep their unique powers to keep the internal knowledge from fading. And what one kind of powers do they have? They require a price to go down there. Now... We, as he points to him, and like uh, like half the city at this point is like outside your house, just like watching, like in, in like just suspense. Because, you know, Aleli seems to be pretty beloved at this point. We do not have capable warriors to go down there. We, we will go down there. I will tell you. Um, I ha- yes, go ahead. I have a question uh, as Jordan. Um, if the key is marked by Os- uh, Osoyo and we are marked by Osoyo and Osoyo seems to affect elves how come I haven't been uh, been affected yet the I, from what I can gather the Osoyo is somewhat protecting in fact I think if you were to touch the key Mr. Jordan you would not be afflicted by the curse how do you know his name I'm assuming you introduce yourself to each other guys I have it. <laughs> if you haven't, then he would just say Mr. Half Elf. Yes. Um, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, 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 Jordan, please. Yeah, yeah. Um, I would. I don't know. With. I don't. I mean, you can risk it, but I think with the imprint of a soyu on you and on the key, you should be theoretically safe from the curse. Otherwise. Okay, well, I'm not going to test that assumption until uh, it, the dire circumstances arise. Fair. Um, Aleli also seems to know your only way home, so please, for the sake of helping us. Um, if I might ask a favor. Yes. Um, this Aleli was speaking of a, a city. Um, I, I... Skywatch? Uh, Skywatch. Um, th- is there any information out there about this place? I think Aleli would be the one to know about this. Uh, are we allowed to maybe search her residence? Would that be... I... He doesn't look comfortable with that. We can roll me diplomacy. I, I, yeah, I will. Wouldn't it be more pertinent to save her life first? I... Yeah. I mean, we... Knowing about Skywatch isn't going to do us anything if we can't get get back, and it sounds like us getting back is is tied to her. Uh, uh, right. Okay. Never mind. I mean, we need the info, yes, but no, no, no. I, I, I mean, Grim is just making sure you know we've got all our exits covered and stuff. I suppose worst case scenario, but of course our priority is um. LLE right now. I Genfiel, I just still can't get over the fact that I'm mm. I'm a warrior now and not a gardener anymore. Is that what you were saying before? You all seem capable of handling yourselves. I think looking at your scars, you seem to have fought some things in the jungle as well. We yeah, are not level three. <laughs> we are not uh, as prepared as you can be. And there are going to be those the memory cache. We go as a last resort. There's gonna be things that have gone in there make the residences up and unknown things for now. If the only way to to go back home and to go to Skywatch, then is that cash, then we, I am sure, will go there to seek more information. It would be appreciated. Please, save and a lily, we'll says one of the other ones. And a lot of the um, crowd agrees. Perhaps we can even find out more information about Skywatch down there. Do you need to rest before... Time is of the essence. The healer will pipe up. She only has four days before she loses her memory. 
I could use some time to mend my wounds. However, if time is of the essence, I will, I'll be fine not resting. It's a full day ahead. Please, um, take advantage. We can offer you supplies. Um, meta wise, you can shop. Uh, no guns or ammo. All right, those are not available. Right. Um, but you can shop up to level. I want to see less guys. Whatever, level five items, all right? Um, if you need to, you can sell stuff. Um, they are, you know, they're willing to help you as much as they can. I will give a 20% discount on all items bought here, all right? Ooh, I am broke, I think. <laughs> um, he is definitely broke. So I've got seven gold. Damn. Yeah, this is totally things. not like D&D. Oh, you mean money-wise? Like a hundred gold. <laughs> yeah, you have some stuff to yeah. sell as well. There's some items you bought and some items you looted yeah, and stuff like fair. that. I will. Um, In fact, before sell. super super sorry, Joy, do me a favor, and I need you to put anything that's not a personal item. Maybe you bought, you found some treasure items or like the the shell of that creature or whatever it is. Put it in loot me, please. Um, I will start disreading the party evenly amongst the gold evenly amongst the party, if 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 at all possible. If you have a personal item you bought or something, you can sell it personally. But otherwise, I would ask that you. I really like the cloak. Damn it! And the oak leaf mask. No, if you want to sell it, you can keep the cloak. If you you don't have to sell it. Oh, this is for selling. This stuff. is for selling stuff. Anything that you want to sell. Stick it oh, in here, yeah. Especially here. treasure yeah. items, and if you found like a like the cloak is an example. If you found a cloak that no one's gonna use or some shit, you can stick that in there as well. No, I want to. I want the cloak. Yeah, guys. then I'll get. I painted it black, guys. <laughs> what is the sell rate? Um, treasure goes one hundred percent. Anything that is not treasure goes fifty percent. Although, so anything although, we bought would would be be sold back at fifty percent. Uh, yes, although I will give you that same discount, uh, so it'd be 60, so I'll have to figure that math out, but yeah. Right? Wait. 60 or, yeah, 20% on buying, 10% on selling, so we'll do that. Are Wait. we allowed to, if we see something someone is selling and we think, hey, I want that, could I take it? Yes, absolutely. Just just okay. make sure you talk about it as well. Okay. Well, I don't see anything right now, just, mm -hmm. if I do. what What's filament good for? Oh, it's rope. Never mind. I'll keep that. Um, I'm good. Everybody put uh, actually, everything they could. No, that's a, that's a temporary item. You can't sell that. Okay. I suppose. What's, that? What's fly leaf? Fly uh, leaf. It's it's drugs. It's weed. It's weed. Yo, I'll sell that. Give me. <laughs> Ooh, I've never seen this before, and suddenly the entire planter of Castrovel was introduced to. It's weed. addicted. Damn. <laughs> they just like me for real. Okay. Anybody? Anything else? Are we good? We're good. We're gonna do the calculations. I'm gonna give you 110. percent I don't know math. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Treasure items are. Let's sell the treasure immediately. We got 37. So I'm gonna 37 times 1.1. 40.7. Three and seven. All right. And then all of this stuff will be sold at 60% cost. So, or you'll get 60% back. So that's 20 plus 10 plus 10 plus 0.3 times 0.6. It's another 24 gold and 18 silver. I did that math right. Oh, it's not 18 silver. It's one silver and eight copper. What? That's uh, eight and add eight copper. Perfect. I'll delete. Is it fly leaf one gold? It's one gold for for each. Yeah. So you get 20. For each? So yeah. it's 20 gold? Yeah. Oh, sick. Yeah. Yeah. You get 20 gold worth of stuff. Interesting plants. All right, well, let's go ahead and uh, distribute these coins. Uh, we got Grim, Helmy, Jardin, Cass, and Anno. We're going to allow coin type conversion. Everybody should have gotten something. Hey, wait, why doesn't Zizlos get a shit? I'm joking. I'm joking. All right, everybody gets 13 gold, one silver, five copper. And there's three copper pieces there that you could, somebody can just take. Just take it. Just somebody, first come, first serve. Just grab it. Grab it. Three copper pieces, free money. 
Yeah. Wow, man. <laughs> All right. So where do we buy stuff again? Never mind. Found it. Grim, you go <laughs> to the magnifying glass with twenty gold. I will say I don't think you can buy much. Um, what the things you guys definitely want, especially for marshals, is a plus one rune for thirty five. Uh, for casters, you could probably save up for a staff. See, or uh, most cheap staff is sixty. Staff of fire is sixty. Yeah. Okay. Sixty. Um, I just need a hand wraps. But yeah, that's, still, does, yeah, that's also thirty five. Yeah. So. Does the weapon potency plus one work for my hand crossbow? It does, but you need more gold for that. Essentially. Hey, anyone want to fund me? <laughs> I think. That's up to you guys. Is there a GoFundMe in Galarian? Or wherever you are right now? I will say, uh, whilst I did offer shopping, maybe you could buy a consumable or two, like a small healing potion or something. Because obviously yeah. they're going to... Wait, those don't work on me, though. Uh, Olive and Life would work on you, Grim. Or Elixir also work on you. Yes. Elixir, fair, Elixirs yeah. work on you. And then, uh, you know, Genthiel doesn't obviously say it, but if you are to save Aleli, there will be a reward. Um, he doesn't specifically oh, oh. state it, but you get the sense that, you know, most people are looking at you, like, expectantly. They will be grateful. I'll get two elixirs of life. Okay. Is that enough? You what can, you yeah. If, don't forget, guys, I don't know if I've stated this very often, but stick consumables in your belt pouch, in your um, containers tab, so that way it doesn't cost an extra action to use. For example, Grim, you can drag that elixir of life to your not the tool belt, the belt pouch, the other one. That'd be oh, the belt pouch. Yeah. I'll put that in. There. Yeah. So um Wait. it's a home rule, it's a house rule that I use. It basically um what's the word? Forgoes the action of pulling the thing out. Pulling the the consumable out. Yeah. So Okay, that's sick. All right. Um give me I'm just gonna put the break time here. When you are done shopping, hit I am back, please. And Grim, considering you're spending uh, a few hours, like say mm -hmm. two hours, you can attempt two medicine checks on yourself, please. Okay. Um, how do I do that? Do I just roll medicine? Just roll me normal medicines. Yeah, don't worry about anything. Okay. Don't worry about macro or anything like that. Just roll me a medicine check. That is a failure on the first one. Roll me another one, please. Oh, I love healing myself. You would hurt yourself unless you were always using a hero point. Uh, sure. I'll heal myself. That'll be funny. <laughs> you'll, Poke a rib. you'll hurt yourself. Roll me 1d8. Okay. Oh, my yeah. God. You didn't say it was that much, Bob. <laughs> All right. You take two uh, damage take two in the damage. second attempt to heal yourself. And then you're going to attempt one more as we get to the start of the memory cache. Yes. So, I'll so not now yet. Not now. When we get to the start of the memory cache, okay. I'll okay. let you attempt one more. Anybody else? can use these hours to refocus or whatnot. I mean, obviously. Um, so join Chad when you are done shopping. Hit, I'm back on the break time, and then we can resume the... I'm just reading. Um... I would recommend you save some of your money, Joy, for later. Yes, for yeah, sure. Yeah, that's for fair. Sure. For a plus one. Yeah, yeah 30. Oh, you yeah. definitely want that plus one. So, excellent. As you guys go through the exotic, exotic as in there in other world, other worldly, other worldly stores, literally, uh, shop there. The, the situation seems grim. Nobody seems to be out. <laughs> nobody seems to be outright like blaming you all. And they don't, but you can see on a couple people, a little bit of resentment and a couple of people like, you know, like hope. Um, at the end of the day, you just cause some trouble, right? You... Can I can I spend some time trying to make an impression? Absolutely. If you're not shopping, go ahead and roll me a diplomacy check. We'll see how you roll, and then you can explain to me how you make the impression. That's a good. That's almost a crit success. Um, and Islas is helping, of course. Well, roll me diplomacy with Islas. If you get a crit, you'll get a plus two for a crit success. Hmm. I would consider that oh. a crit. That's fine. Oh. I lower the DCs on aid sometimes. So that's a 26 for a crit success. <clears throat> what do you do, Ano? 
Um, I just like start being like, oh, we're so sorry. And just talking about the how the jungle here is beautiful and it reminds, you know, what, what it's like back home and talk about how Islos is a, actually a plant from back home that's come alive. And we were just trying to, we, uh, just my story, like we came out the portal together and I've been trying to find a place for her to find her roots ever since, but it's been difficult. And like, we didn't mean to bring this here, but we'll, we'll help. Alali? Al uh, Alali? Alali. Al 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 and at the end of that time, most elves seem, what's the word? Amicable, for sure. Some of them look at you with pity, but pity as in like, you know, you accidentally just almost killed someone, right? That sucks. I'm sorry to, you know, kind of thing. And you definitely get a lot of support from the elves at the end of this. Like any resentment that might have been in their eyes has gone just just by you being you on them, essentially. They, they ascertain they're not. You guys are, I don't want to say innocent. I don't know if innocent bystanders or maybe just, you know, naive to what what could have happened, if that makes sense. Yeah. You could say we're just victims of a stolen fate. That's the wrong campaign. Oh, you, you know, like it's I a great, it's a great yeah. name drop. Maybe in ten yeah, levels. But I mean, like, uh, yeah. If I was, just, as I mean, in seven levels, it'll like all. You know, I'm just foreshadowing. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, that's like almost a hero point, but not quite. You're gonna make another joke for the hero point, Ottoman. Yes, uh, it's gotta be organic though. Don't force it. I work on it. Thank you. Um. All right. Do you guys ready to go to the memory cache? Let's go. Yep. Question like real quick. Yes. Is this like old stairway? Is that the memory cache? Like going down to it? Like on the. Uh, art? Uh, most of these arts are kind of what's the word? Interpretive. In, not an interpret. Up, up for interpretation. Yeah, up for interpretation, like, like just stylistic. But we could say that's yeah. the way down to the memory. Cache. It does, like to me, when they said it was below the city. I think yeah, yeah. I, I, I would, I wouldn't say no. I would say sure. Let's go down from on these stairs to the memory. It cache. looks like it has a cool, uh, like elevator. All right, Genthiel will accompany you all the way to the, as far as he can, and then he says, "It's uh, one more medicine check." Uh, when we get there. Uh, okay. Yeah, he will say, oh, "We don't know much. It's been a hundred years since anybody's journeyed there. The route to the Grotta's entrance has been straightforward as I've led you here. But after that, the cavernous entryways, you are not certain what you can find. Please find the gardeners who tend to that place. They will help you find Iscariel and retrieve the knowledge we need. And with that, we'll move you to." The a memory cache. Dun dun dun. Oh, I've got a sound effect. Dun dun dun. Where's my dun dun dun? No, this one. That's the wrong one. There we go. Better. Thank you. Thank you. I love that one. I've oh. been using it in my games too. Oh, <laughs> all right. So I'm gonna move you to the memory cache. Um, this is a, this is a, after a few winding corridors. Let me do a thing before we do this. Um, let's... can I uh, put in Chuck and Reaper? Yes, you can put in Chuck and Reaper. Um, let's go ahead and do I need a break? Kind of want a 10 minute. Does anybody need a break? 10 minute break? I'm fine with a break. Yeah, yeah sure. Break. Sure. Okay. Let's just do 10 minutes and then we'll start with this dungeon as they call it. See you in a bit. Is it a mega dungeon? Yeah, put the Windows key up. Windows key space. No, sé. Ahora mismo no puedo. Ya empezó. All right. I know we got a little time, but. I'm gonna hit the break time thing here. Now who's back? I'm back. I'm just frog keeping. Frog keeping, frog keeping. Because for some reason they need to like eat or something, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't know why they do that. That's pretty weird. Brian. And of all the things they eat crack crickets. I don't get it. Right, when bonus crack comes crickets. Crack crickets. Crack crickets. Oh, I hope bonus is gonna be a little bit longer because I'm grabbing a drink because I've got <laughs> Go, 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 go. And bonus has returned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now, um, Joy is AFK. <laughs> I was only 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. All right, okay. Cyril, get on webcam, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do yeah, the I thing. You might as well. Do the thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got it. All right. Oh, God, I was going to say something important. I guess it doesn't matter. It's not important. Everything you say matters. No, it doesn't. Ah! Damn it. It was important. It was it was important. But you know what? It's fine. Oh. Let's we're gonna go back in game. Uh oh, blah 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 blah. Exploration activities. Are we doing the same? I'm changing? I'm not changing. Definitely I'm not be changing. defending. Detecting magic. I'm cool. Where are you, Jordan? Oh, there you are. I'm on a black screen somewhere. There I am. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see if scouting's on everyone. Perfect. Welcome to the memory cache. I'm going to put some uh, dungeon like music, I guess. There we go. Um. A few winding corridors lead you to this corner. The walls are 15 feet high. What do you guys do? It's roll not, there's medicine. not, there's not much of a description, guys. It's literally a cave. Roll me, roll, use the macro for me, Grim. Okay. I can't target myself. Zoom. Yes. Or move anything. I'm going to read. Um, I don't have problems. Perfect. We're going to. Gonna roll automatically here, and we're able to apply the treat wounds immunity on you, Grim. Yay! Oh no! No, I am not as dead as before. Actually, it's of course I'm alive. Three p.m. and then I'll apply the treat wounds immunity. There we go. All right. Uh huh. What you guys like to do? Send Reaper forward. Okay. Hell me, is that your light? Does Reaper have dark vision? That really helps, though. Uh, I'm pretty sure she has low light. I have light as well. She's got low light, but not dark vision. It's completely dark. Damn. Okay, come back, buddy. Does Chuck mm. have dark vision? Anyone want to light no. cast on them? Uh, uh, cast on Reaper. Because if she's Reaper. going forward, then she can scout out the cave for us. Uh, sure. Oh, uh, she has a little collar, maybe, or something that you can cast it on. Perfect. All right, I'll just yeah send her forward to do her thing. Okay. Can I look through her eyes or? Mm, you... She's got a. She's got a report back to you. Um, do you want to? Do you want me to move her forward and just have her come back? Again, yeah, looking can... through her eyes is a familiar ability, so I want to keep it you know immersive if that makes sense. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, I'll. I'll uh, I guess we'll wait. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, send her back when she's done. Okay. You want me to send her forward? Correct. Yeah. Okay. She'll fly up and above 15 feet as she suddenly needs to roll two of these. Oh. <clears throat> Do you want me to click that? Click on Reaper, and then if you can, if you don't see Reaper, 
Uh, you can move yourself forward a little bit to see Reaper. Yeah, no, I, I see her. Okay. One twice, right? Yes. One. Ouch. Oh. I think she's dead. As ah. she flies forward from the walls, actually, Islos can probably see it from a corner, so I'll reveal it to everybody. Sure. <gasps> Oh, yeah. that's nasty. That's it's like great. a monkey with a bird and a spider. And they seem oh. to use a beam of volatile psychic energy towards Reaper as she takes. Oh shit! You didn't see my dice roll. I'm gonna I'm gonna re-roll with the dice roll. Hold on. If she dies, can I call her back? Uh. Yes. It's a week at that time to make a new connection with a new animal. But I don't want a new animal. This is Reaper. Just... Shit. That's, uh... Maybe That's you, you should send her for... <laughs> Alright, yes, Reaper is going to screech as she internally cooks from the inside. As she yeah. falls... Um, does she get death saves? With that amount of damage, I guess she'd be level three. Hold on, she has twenty-five HP. Yeah, she does. She 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 only took that much, so that's like forty-ish. Out of that, her twenty-five HP is. She falls to the ground. She's gonna start rolling death saves. Roll initiative for me if you guys want to save Reaper. Yep. Of course we do. I don't know. I feel like Grim should learn a lesson. Wow! <laughs> wow! <laughs> I'll remind. I'll, I'll I'll keep that in my mind next time you're dying. <clears throat> okay, yeah. <laughs> like, I can't roll. You can't roll for shit today, man. That's pretty bad. I haven't rolled apart from on that diplomacy. <clears throat> Jordan. Oh boy. I will move myself up to see what's going on. You see two of these things on the walls, 15 feet high. Okay. Um, well, we need to get in there, so I will... Let's see if this works. You finish your first action stride for... Oh, okay. You're gonna, no, no. Okay, you're not gonna do that. You're gonna ray of frost. Perfect. Target it. Um, let me just double check here. They are gonna have a little cover from you. If that still hits. Roll me damage. Take seven damage. That is the end of my turn. Cass. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man, I'm gonna cool. Cool. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna start moving down here. Let's see here. To get to there. Let's see. And I will. I'm getting Soothe on Reaper. Soothe on Reaper. Yeah. It's nice to have gas. No problem. We'll hear 11 for 11 points. had a spell effect soothe on her. Reaper is still prone. Yeah, but probably going to be useful for, for this. With these guys, at least. Mm -hmm. Help me. Ugh. Okay. Uh... You're no, yeah, you're battle medicine. It's the same day. Shit. 15. Okay, that's the first action. What's your movement total? 50? Uh, uh, at this point, I can move 25 feet. Okay, so if you want to... I can move you to your... to Like, I can move you through the people. Or you can just move yourself, it's fine. Your 50 would be here if you want to use two actions to move. Right here if you want to do that. Do, yes. Perfect. And uh, at this point, I suppose I should draw my sword, yes? Would you guys have not been adventuring into an unknown cave full of dark horrors without a sword drawn? 
Well, I mean, I, they said know, there would be enemies. So I, if I, they said there were enemies here, then I think I would. Yeah. In which case, I'm going to change that to raise my shield. Perfect. Go ahead and hit the macro for me. Oh, hell me, hell me, hell me. My armor's on this time, so I ain't going to get hit like that squirrel did. Or not squirrel, <laughs> snail. A telepathic beam hits you. Oh, that's cheating. I need you to hit this button. This button. And where's my... Oh, they broke it. Hold on, DC. Reaper! Oh no, help me. Oh. And this button. Nine, ten. Nine. Congrats. Not nine. Ooh. Still, how? What the hell? That is great. I need you to do the same thing again. <laughs> Damn. This That's button. nasty. This button. And I gotta edit the last one, but it's basically lower DC every time. Um, so just roll high on the first ones. Well done. Oh Damn. man, you're succeeding on all of these. They carry us. They're starting to get Why? frustrated. Hey. Grim. Oh man. Why, is it, why do I have to? How do I follow up on that? <laughs> Uh, you said with bird. a big axe. That's, you know, a good point. Um, I guess I would have my axe out and with my new feet. And with my new... Oh, they're up. <laughs> no, I said, I said I thought, you know, I have... I, 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 I have 35 feet now, so I thought, you know, maybe I can get up to them. But I just no. thought it was funny. It was like, oh, they're up. Yeah, yeah, yeah I up. get it, Pablo. Yeah. You, you love to smite me. Um, so that's my movement, and then I will make... The left one, my prey. Okay. You uh, had your axe I, out. You said you would have to switch. No, no, no I. Mm, I don't know. You, uh, you can be honest with me and yourself. What would you have had out? Crossbow or axe or both? I yeah. think Grim was currently focusing on the crossbow, but I thought when Helmy said use your axe, I was wanting to strike with my axe. So I, I'll stay with my crossbow. Okay. I'll, I think that's what Grim works for me. Target and use hunt prey. Hunt prey. You are now my prey, and I will now fire my bow. We don't just don't really use a whole lot of crossbows uh, in the Lenorm King, in the Lenorm Kingdom. So I don't think about Hero them that point. much. Hero point. I'll Sometimes we get like the children to learn on them. You know, when you're too young to really pull the bow real good. That's what Grim's doing, I think. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Gain that hero point, Arnavan. All right, yeah. Arnavan, what are you doing? I feel like we're going to get contentious with Grim soon. Sorry, Grim. Yeah, I'm going to back off I, of you, Joey. It, it was funny the first time, but... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, 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 I'm going to just say... Wait, okay. How high is the ceiling where Islos is? Is it like... Is it at... Is lost his head height, and then it gets bigger 15, as it goes into the fifteen, and then it grows bigger exponentially in the next room. Yeah. Okay. If I gave Islos a climb speed, would Islos then be able to go along the walls? Well, yes, Pythagorean. To... I, I know it's like not raw, but to, I like Pythagorean. like here. I like Pythagorean. Kind of, I guess you could climb. You could do diagonals, but it's five and ten, five and ten. Keep that in mind. Let, let's double. That's okay. what I mean, though. Yeah, yeah. So, like, I want I want Islos to get onto the ceiling. Uh, the ceiling is like 60 feet high on this. So it Okay, I want Islas to get to the wall okay. here. What is Islas' movement with a climbing speed? Give me the climbing speed, please. 25. 25. I've, so got to, I've got to cast Evolution Surge first. Then she would move okay. here, but and she, then she'd attack. But she wouldn't move 25 vertical as well, is my, is my thing. It would be the same as Pathfinder... Di diagonal movement, you know, when it's five and yeah, then ten. Yeah, five so that's, and that's ten. what I'm asking. That's what I'm asking. Oh, I see. You did do it that way. Okay, but also one more diagonal, I guess, would be the. Um, I mean, okay. okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's weird math. It's weird math. It's five, and then five up. You know what? Just move there. It's fine. I don't want to do this. Yeah, it's fine. Just move there. It's fine. <laughs> do it. Do it. I can't move through the wall, but I will just get to the. Uh, sorry, this is whilst I'm doing evolution surge, so... Uh, Spadoop. 
No, not that one. That's not what I wanted. I, they somehow switched around as I was casting it. That's super fun. This one. Yay. Uh, that one. So then she moves with the act together thing. And then she's going to reach out with her tendril. And smack. Tendril strike. Oh, for God's sake. This is every single roll so far has been like, oh, it's a high number, and over to the low one. That's it. That's the end of my turn. That's your turn, Jordan! Jordan! <clears throat> it's me. Um, Jordan is going to take a good look at these creatures and see if maybe he might be able to discern anything about them. Absolutely. Roman and Arcana, Nature, DC 20. That's a critical success. You learn a few things. One, okay. they have heat sense. If you jump into water, you will be concealed against their heat. That's free information I'll give you. I'll even give you this. Yeah? So it's pretty cool because they were annoying my other party a lot if they jump into the water. But anyway, what is one thing about this stuff like you want to know? I would like to know their uh, weakest saving throw. Fortitude plus six. Fortitude. So I will ho holler out... Uh, they're not very tough guys, um, but the, oh, they're pretty tough. I think their <laughs> uh, their mental fortitude might be pretty high. So, and then with oh. that, I will cast another ray of. I frost. googled that. Uh, the flowers of some plants produce enough heat to raise the temperature to 35 degrees above air temperature. Man, I don't know. I don't. I think Islos makes just plants. All right, from where you are, Jordan, he does have half cover, and that'll mess because uh -huh. of cover. Yeah. Wait. And that is my turn. Excellent, Cass. <laughs> I will uh, start by doing the mold, the mold, living composition, and let me get you that performance roll. Here you go. Hell oh. yeah. Is it a crit? I don't. Uh, I think it is. Um, I think it is. Yeah, four. So four. Yep, yeah, yeah, four. Yep. Awesome. 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 Four rounds, and I will do a threatening ap approach. They are 15 feet up. Oh, they're 15. Oh, sorry, yep, no mind then. I, that wouldn't make sense. I couldn't get up there. Uh, uh, let's see here. I'm just gonna let's see how far away. I can never. I can check this one, or I can't check that one. Yeah. No. Mooring. Uh, 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 I will just, I'll just uh, electric arc that one only. Actually, to double check, 15 and 25 is actually 29, so you could theoretically do oh. both. Oh, yep. all right, yep, yep, all right, I'm doing both then. Nah, bastards, bastards. They're, they just skittered along the wall there. The one on the left will take half. I guess the one on the right. I don't know. Yeah, the one on the right will take half. Perfect. Is that your turn, Cass? <clears throat> uh, yep, that's two actions. Hell me! Uh, okay. Um, let's see. Neither one of them I hope you're all okay over there. Neither one of them have been hit, so let's go here. Uh, 15, 15 feet, feet down, feet yeah. Up, so I don't think I can get to it from where I am. But it will take a free action to store my shield. And I will climb. It's a free action to drop your shield. I'll take a free action to drop my shield, and I will climb. You need two both hands free to climb, right? I need both hands free to climb? I'm pretty sure, unless you have a feet. Yeah, so combat climber, is the only one that? I will take a free action to drop both of them then. <laughs> get this motherfucker. <laughs> All right, that's a critical success on where you are. You can move mm -hmm. 10 feet up. Okay, and uh, now this is GM's, uh, with GM approval, can I grab this thing with both of my hands, call it causing both of us to fall to the ground? <clears throat> yeah, you'll need a grapple first. So you haven't attacked yet. A climb is not an attack trait. So just roll me a contested. Not contested. That's D&D. &D. Just roll me grapple against their athletics DC. I think it is. Or is it 40? 
Fortitude. Fortitude, yeah. So DC, whatever the fortitude is, which is 16, as we just heard. Okay. Got this. Oh! And you got him. You grab him with both hands, and both of you crash to the ground. You take five damage, tell me, as you fall. And he will take, I guess, seven. As you both fall, and you both land prone. Nice. Is that what the outcome you were expecting, give or take? Pretty much, actually. Perfect. I'm glad that happened. Well, the Amolus. Is he still grappled? Hmm. Would he still be considered grappled with that? So you're, you're grabbing him and then just letting go as you drag him. I wouldn't have let go of him. I would have let go of the wall. So I'm pretty sure I'd be prone... Both of us would be prone, but he'd still be grappled. I'll allow it. Emolus. Nobody's heard him yet. I wanted to, but even the hero point couldn't make it. He's going to crawl down. He's got 40 movement. 15. 20. I think this is what he would do. I'm so sorry. He's going to scratch at Reaper. No! Like, just try to chomp at Reaper. Get off her! Nice. As Reaper just flaps and caws and just moves away. Ah! Um, do you make a lot of noise, Grim? Me? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I, get, I'm, I like to think Grim is a bit quiet. Did but... you say get off her, or did you just stare silently and solemnly? Silently and solemnly, but he's mad. I'm gonna attempt one more time to hit Reaper. <laughs> Get the Amolus will try to him. cook Helmy's body. Hit, no. hit, hit me the fortitude save him or er, Helmy. Nice. Fuck's sake! All right, he's gonna try mm -hmm. to escape. Wait, what is your... Is it your reflex? Oh, God, it still doesn't one, beat two, it. Low, baby. And he's gonna just jaw MAP you. Man, these things suck. Grim, what are you doing? Hello, I am uh, running... Well, actually, not running. I will reload my crossbow, first of all. Then, second action to shoot the creature. Hold on, let me damage. Nice. For that much damage? It's it's still barely injured. Jeez. Um, okay. And can I command Reaper? As a third action, what do you tell her to do? Um I'll Reaper, just get out of here, flee. She'll have to stand up from prone and then fly. Mm. Which direction? You can uh, move her. Probably. Okay. I'll move her here. She can move... How much can she move? Normally. Half of her normal speed, I assume. No, just, just her like fly speed is 60, so she can move a shit ton. <clears throat> oh, okay, she's gonna go like here. Yeah. Reaper, come to me. Onovan. <laughs> uh, so, Reaper's not dead. How did Reaper get back up? Soothed by Cass. Hell yeah, Cass. Uh, just stay here with me. Chuck and I will look after you. I, I, I don't know if I can fucking... The bird can fucking understand me or not. I am Chuck! Yeah, you know, I, I know you can. Uh, right. I'm sure his loss is fine, but I'll, I'll give them some help anyway. Uh, Onovan's going to use Boost Idol on. And his loss is going to be the hero we all know is the the real protagonist out of the two of them. <laughs> um, uh, I guess they're both on the floor now. Do you have to climb down 15? So I'll move 15 and then my 10 to get to here. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, I'll start attacking. Uh, first attack.
Oh, it doesn't have cover. <sighs> that hits. Yeah, thank God. Uh, that's the first attack. 11. Not bad, not bad. Um, and then I'll try and MOP it. Come on, roll above a 10. Yeah! Bad, roll me damage. Roll also above a 10 on a D8. <laughs> I mean, I can't. <laughs> That's your turn? Yes. Beautiful, Jordan. Jordan is going to move forward. Right up here. And click on the right thing so I can move. There we go. All right. And he's going to charge a good old spell strike with Gouging Claw against oh. this one. Let's see. Macaroni. Gouging Claw. Uh, one handed. I did not change my stance. <laughs> and we will do. I'm hoping this is as good or better than last time. Fuck. Uh. <laughs> um, you know what? I'll, I'll use a hero point on, can, on that. Can you manually subtract and use a macro again, please? I can. That'd be great. Maybe. There we go. Man, these things are... You guys are demolishing this encounter. Good, good on you guys. Oh, shit! <laughs> Oh, there shit. we go. There we go. Oh, shit. Boom. Okay. Well, then. It's got one HP left. I'm going to keep it. <laughs> That's what it's I'm going to keep it. Yeah, yeah. No, it's got one HP. I'm going to be it. If it has one HP, it has one HP, man. It's still alive. Hey. Just like his cool. guts are on the floor, basically. Oh, God. Well done, Jarden. Thank you, Cass. Thank you. Mommy, uh, not to get on the wrong side of you, Jordan. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna electric arc. Oh, okay. Both well, he's done. Dead. They're dead. Look <laughs> at crit. You don't know that. I could crit succeed. Now, I kind of hate to do this to myself, but given that I'm holding on to one while it takes electric damage. Six dead. I don't think it's survive, right? Yeah, All right, and then how me can punch the last one to death. You have one more action, Cass. Uh, yeah, um, I'll move to give uh, Helmy flanking. God, hell yeah! All right, well, Helmy, he's like finish him. Yeah, I've got that. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, <laughs> reminder of the you know, uh, <laughs> the village's old uh, hog wrestling contest as she's just you know going in for the uh, the punch to knock this. Poor wretched thing out. Yes! yes. Fucking slay! <laughs> I cannot. Uh, okay, all right. Well, good job! You know, my other. I just want to. Just want to. Fatality. want to anecdote. My other party took two hours and a half in this combat. And what? they kept. Wait, <laughs> other party sucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, yeah. It just apparently it was. It was kind of funny and sad how they just died to these. They. I mean, that was. As, that was as in the Kanipo fight, let's be honest. That's true. That's true. They did better in the Kanipo fight. So you win some, you lose some. Well done. You guys destroy these things with ease. What do you do? Well, one of the bodies. This one is actually still alive, technically. Oh, okay. So sure. You could Helmy would Helmy's kind of would be kind of concerned about killing them. She would ask the party. I, I don't know. She, you don't think these things are sacred to them or nothing, do you? I mean, I feel like we already kind of got off on the wrong foot when we... And I know, take my axe and decapitate it. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, that, that just happened. I'm going to grab the head and take it with me. Well, you know, I guess you you deserve that trophy. <laughs> I won't say anything while I'm doing this. I'm going to come uh... back. I'm looking for my uh, my bird. You can treat one oh, just... bird if you want. Uh, well, actually, can I heal companion? You can do that as well. It might be more beneficial to that. treat wounds first. That way, you could heal companion in emergency in battle. But that just just That's to fair. min max it, yeah. If you want. Yeah, to. it is a focus spell. It's true. I'll I'll treat wounds it. I'm just gonna refocus whilst I'm doing that. 
Yes, it takes 10 minutes for Reaper to heal. Uh, as many there you time go, it's on. okay. Uh, You're gonna be okay. Uh. Um, I've got a... Do I have a cowing noise? Oh, I have an owl noise. I have a chicken. Alright, sorry. <laughs> Close <laughs> enough. Close enough. Um, 10 minutes are passing. I'm just refocusing. Grim's healing. What are you doing to help me? Uh, honestly... Not really sure. Not like I really need to refocus. Uh, Helena would probably look around to make sure these things haven't, you know, made a nest here or something. Let me a perception. So the one thing you ascertain is they do like living near water because... Hmm, you could roll me a recall knowledge if you'd like, or Connor Nature to figure out why these things like water. Maybe? I am not good at either one of those. Mm. I think Islos would like to. Go ahead, Islos. Uh, let me uh, help you out there, help me. What, what are you trying to look for here? Well, you know, I'm trying to make sure that there aren't going to be more of them. So I'm seeing if they've got a nest here, or if like we're going to be jumped by a bunch of babies. I always feel bad. Well, that about makes babies. sense. I have a crow. Okay. Oh, stop it. Okay. Well, she's a raven, so... Okay, whatever. But, you know, close enough. Um, same family. That's right. That's right. Um, same family. See? Jordan. Okay. All right. Um, <laughs> so, what you ascertain... I made it private, but I don't know. I, yeah, I forgot I should have rolled the secret sauce. No. I, I, I specifically asked for secret ones. Otherwise, you do your publics. Um, you ascertain that these things are scared of their own body heat, if that makes sense. Um, they are actually, um, uh, they need to jump in water every once in a while to submerge themselves to uh, stop themselves from boiling from their own psychic. Well, they Gosh. really like cooking, so. Uh, it's kind of like... Uh... You know, fungus like to grow in the dark and keep cool. Uh, I suppose it's something like that. They uh, got to keep moist and in a damp and dark place. You well, know, now I feel kind of bad about killing them. I mean, probably had it coming since they went after Reaper and all, but, you know, any oh, sort of no. critter that's too dumb to keep from cooking itself is something that I feel like you got to keep an eye out for. Yeah, they... I mean, I imagine they uh, came in here, uh, well, I imagine when Reaper came in here, they they were expecting it was an easy meal. I, I don't think they were necessarily acting maliciously. Yeah, they just they were just hungry. Cass, what are you doing for 10 minutes? Uh, I'll just refocus. Mm -hmm. Jordan? Um, I'm going to extend my presence through my uh, detecting magic and seeing you if I can detect anything and listening and what's, what's just your discerning. magic detect magic level? Is it still one? Uh, the level of the spell? It's level two. Okay. Level two. Yeah, yeah, double check. Two, yeah. Double checking. Okay, you detect magic. I do. You don't know where. You don't know how. <laughs> you don't know. But it's 30 feet around you. I'll put the 30 feet of emanation. So I'll okay. holler out, hey, I'm uh, detecting a magical Ooh. aura from magical. somewhere nearby. Maybe it has something to do with those statues across it's the It's very faint. Water. It's very faint. That is a good question. Do you think it could have something to do with them weird statues? Well, I would say Reaper fly over, but I doubt that's a good idea. How um, about so I just I'm... jump across? Uh, guys, yeah. before we continue, um, I need exploration activities. Anovan, hit the recall knowledge button. Uh, cast secret perception. Yep, secret perception. You're gonna boss, man. Gotcha. And recall knowledge, Anovan, per favor. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll give you, I'll give you information if needed. What do you guys do? Uh, I I'm think try to jump to this little. Uh, yeah, it's easy. Uh, it's easy enough to cross this river. How deep is it? Pretty deep, like twenty like feet. If I stepped in, twenty, like, knee, oh, 20 feet. Yeah. Okay. It's I'll, I'll follow Helmy across. I guess when she's over. 
You see, Helmy, what seems to be the Scholar's Cave. Many of these walls have been carved into a dozen of bas-relief statues. Many are familiar humanoids wearing robes and carrying books for stays, while others are insectile, reptilian, rodential, or completely unrecognizable. What do you think these people were? All right. Who's got an oh. intelligence score? If oh, you no. have an intelligence score of above 12. Raise, that ain't me. Raise your hand. Not me either. I'm stupid. All I know is killing. Jordan, anybody I'm else? I've got a I've got a 14. Anybody else? <laughs> All I know is killing. Oh, shit. Just Jordan. No way. Really? We are not a high. We are dumb. Party. That's hilarious. You will avoid this trap except Jordan because you're dumb. Uh, Anno, would you have moved as well? I'm assuming. Yeah. Sorry. Wait, wait, wait. I would I would have not avoided the track because I'm dumb. <laughs> Anno's got Anno's got twelve and uh, as well. Anno, you okay there, buddy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I just saw my beam bug because my back hurts. I gotcha. If you don't, if you if you can't play, let me know. I mean, you're. you're, you're... Yeah, no, I'm all good. Okay, Anno, you have twelve. Jarden, you have fourteen. I need both mm -hmm. of you to roll me a. If you could possibly roll me a. No, that's not it. Reveal. Yeah, hit this button. Both of you. But okay. I, I've only got 12. I'm stupid. No, you're smart. You're no, st stop it. You're the second <laughs> smartest in the group. Um, uh, what? No. Yeah, not too smart. Not so, wrong. Jordan, uh, while you are smart, uh, uh, in terms of trap revealing, like Cass was looking out for traps, he failed his perception check, to be honest with you. So, Ufaroni. This is a trap. This is a trap. This is a trap that only it's affects smart people. Oh, well, I'm not oh, boy. smart. Good for me. <laughs> that's um, a reversal. It's, need intelligence, man. It's that's like that one scene in the That's how it be. All right. Uh, Jordan, you will take 10. Onovan, you will take 20, and I'll explain what is happening. <laughs> Fuck me. You are all over. Your mind is overwhelmed of particularly intelligent creatures. You relive every intellectual failure and shame you've ever suffered. So like real life. Um, as it's like a midlife crisis. <laughs> you are going to relive every intellectual failure and shame you've ever suffered, and that just hurts. It hurts you so much, you get a blinding like migraine. At this point, we're going to roll initiative. Oh, what are we fighting? The statue? The trap. Or they're the trap. The traps the and trap. Pathfinder roll initiative, yes. Traps and find some traps and oh. Pathfinder roll as initiative. <laughs> Words. You know what I'm Complex saying. Traps. I mean, as long as they're not gay. The traps aren't gay, right? Yeah. Only two complex traps are nasty. <laughs> Oof. I saw one. <laughs> on a land, a sonic there. streak. All right. That's not a good streak, but a streak. What, what did the trap get? The trap got a thirty-four in initiative. <laughs> yep. Makes sense. Makes sense. I don't know how traps work in Pathfinder. Don't worry, you're they about to find my out. My current my current mean roll is six. My median is four. Just saying. <laughs> Uh, what do we know if this is a trap or a hazard? Or it's a hazard, yeah, for sure. Yeah, how many? How many probably too dumb? Okay. <laughs> so at this point, you see Onovan and Jarden just recoil in pain as a wave of just energy crosses over you all. Except most of you are just too dumb to realize this. It's oh. <laughs> it's just like this. It's fine. I this love it. This is just so mean. <laughs> um, what I We're need just too stupid to understand. Is, oh God, I need as but you know what? You will all see this, of course. The eyes light up on these statues as I need... Well, they, yeah, I need Jarden and, and Ottoman to each roll me another will save. I'm sorry. Oh, boy. Hi, Dukin. Ugh. A failure. Ugh. Kitty. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. How how is it twenty one effect? I don't know why. Oh, no, when did you come oh, in? No. Hi. Oh no! You will both take this much damage. Is there any way to stop this? Oh, yes, disabling the trap. Disabling the trap. But where is the trap? I will tell. I will tell you. Okay. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Now that it's your turns, you can do one or two things. One, just run forward and just ignore this. You know the trap is in this area. 
it's all these statues that are lighting up. The second thing is you can roll me a recall knowledge DC level four, which is a DC blah, 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 blah. a DC nineteen Arcana. Well, recall knowledge. I think it just depends on the trap. I think this one would be Arcana. To be perfectly blunt with you, to figure out how to disable the trap and then use two actions. I think it's called disable device to disable the trap. What would it be possible to dispel magic, maybe? You could certainly try, Cass. It's your turn. What do you want to do? Yeah, I want, I want to try and dispel magic. If I think... Yeah, I'm going to try. That's a, I want to use a new spell. Go ahead. So, roll me the counteract check, please. You got it, boss man. Oh, yeah. That is a success. Which means nice. the counteract, the target of his counteract will is three... Or less. Unfortunately, this hazard is level four. Sam. You try to dispel this magic. Unfortunately, you need it. Is that how it works? Yeah, it's a second level dispel magic. The hazard is a level four hazard. So it. it, uh, it they can usually have a. a Traps can have a special DC, but it's not all of them. Yeah, counteract DC is 20. So, um, yeah, he got wait, right? actually, double so, ch double check for me. This is what it says. Does that mean the dispel magic is level 20 or the this the trap DC is level 20 or the trap uh level is second? Count contract DC is 20. Is a trap for second level for second level for one of the oh, I, I thought I answers. think counteract, I think on traps and hazard is half the level, right? Yeah. Count. Uh, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, okay. On traps, traps and hazard, it's half yeah, the level. Yeah, So you will count. Features and items as well. Yeah, yeah, you will counteract yep. it. Okay, that's fine. Um, nice. So the trap is disabled. That is the Ooh. counter. Boom. Magic. Good job, guys. Thank you. Wow, I didn't even realize something was happening. What so just happened? Like, it only yeah. happened to like the dumb people around us. So yeah, man. Like the uh, I don't think they're dumb. Am well, I dumb? nothing happened Actually, to you. No, what? Don't tell me. Yeah, nothing Where's happened what? to you. It only yeah. happens to those with low intellect, I think. Yeah, well, I, I think don't we know. should uh, help Anavan and uh, John. That's I'm the... sorry, Jar. My it's brain okay. hurts so much. You have to come to terms with your stupidity. I have a migraine now. It, oh, it yeah. must be so much easier not having a brain. <laughs> oh. uh, you know, I was going to save these for my... Oh, never mind. Lay on it. You That's lay. for Anavan. That could be oh, nice man. for once, on but, you know... And mm. oh, thank you so yep. much. No problem, no problem, compadre. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Just need to rest. Do you spend another ten minutes, guys, or no? Uh, I, about uh, I would uh, sure uh, we should spend ten minutes somewhere where the statues start. You know. Shooting. Yeah, yeah. We should. We should. We should at least go to the next room before we rest. Yeah. Agreed. There's gonna be something else in the next room. That's that sounds risky, room. but let's do it. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> it's more, if, they, if they activate again, you know, I don't think uh, you want to be even, here. Are you well, I'm not smart. Are you so. Oh, you... no. Oh, oh no. no. That's, that's that pretty bad. No, no that, looks, that looks horrible. I did tell you. I'm just really playing the right height right oh. now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. This is a... Roll initiative. Wait, I would have... I would have moved oh, a little yeah. bit forward. No, wait. No, I I'll, just... I'll, I'll get you. I'll get you. I got you. I got you. Don't worry. Um... Roll initiative. Just my little legs. Just move forward. I'm coming. Move forward a little bit, yeah. And then roll initiative for me, please, please guys. Oh, no. Oh, no, we don't like this. I do not like this. It screams on that, man. Wow, you're By smart. Yes. Thank you. You should have uh, gone that track. Yes. Yeah, sure. thank you. For Pathfinder, when you roll initiative, you can like roll it for perception and stuff like that. When would you roll it differently? If you if want to roll you... stealth for initiative, you can use the avoid notice exploration activity. Yeah. And then you can start start if you're behind cover, you can roll stealth for initiative. Uh, yeah. which gotcha. which is Because my my rogue has like a um a, I think it's a, a feat. feat. Yep, so yeah. you, Where you, it's you like use he the can, he yeah, can yeah. use yeah. like yeah. exploration activity or something like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Where are your weapons drawn, guys? 
Yeah. You'd also uh, talk yeah. to do stuff like Claire. Uh, what would have been if statues gotcha. start shooting? You know? you know what? I'm okay with you drawing weapons at the same time as these skeletal champions rise up from the ground. All right? So oh, yeah, that yeah, works, have works for me. Onovan, let's put some battle music. What are we doing? Mr. Mythambit, you're muted. Sorry. Yeah. No, I wasn't quite speaking yet. I'm just, just having a tink. <laughs> Uh, Islas is going to move in. Okay. That's what you're fighting. Uh, okay. And then, as Islas moves in, I'm going to... Uh, I'll boost. The skeletal champions do not seem to react to any words. Uh, and I'm going to go for this one here. Perfect. Target, if you could, and then attack a Roni. Ooh! Oh! Nice! Look at that. That is great. Who's complaining about the rolls? Not you, not today. You hit the critical button for me. Hit the critical button! Hit the critical button! But I rolled a seven, that was so good! I'm You're gonna get me double ones now. Look at yeah. that! <laughs> Alright, I'll let you reroll. We still only rolled I'm one in. die. I'll let you reroll once, just, just to get the higher number. I, it's fair, it's fair. Okay. Alright, just hit the button one more time, but the higher number and that's it. And this is I'm nice. Okay, all right. That'll do. I'll all take right, it. All right. I'll take it. Crunch! The skeletal champion. Bones fly it everywhere as you just destroy part of its body. One more action, it's close. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm feeling lucky. Kind of making let's, me feel Let's bad. just take it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I mean... You have to make the trade. <laughs> That's a pretty good luck. I'll give you that. All Duality right. Man. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Is that your turn, Onovan? All right. The skeletal champion will start moving forward. One action to get it here. One action to strike at Islos. What's he got? A longsword? Sure. I'll strike at Islos with a longsword. Why not? That's going to do no damage to Islos. He's going to raise his shield with his third action. Because he can. Because he's got a crappy little shield. All right, this one's going to just attack with his glaive. Wait, what? They said he had a glaive. You stupid. Oh, it's a lance. Okay, there we go. He's going to attack with his lance. No, okay. He's going to attack with his lance again. There we I go. I feel bad about this. <laughs> and then he's going to go ahead and attack. Oh, no, that's dope. Nope, hold on, hold on. I didn't. Okay, let me do five damage to to uh, Onovan, and then lastly, he's gonna. You know what? He's gonna he's gonna step here. The skeletal champion is gonna shamble up and attack with his lance, but he's gonna attack at Cass instead. Oh, fuck you! Get Ouch. rickety wrecked. He's gonna attack one more time. Oh, that'll miss. Good, grim. Well, this uh, feels kind of awkward, but uh, all part of it, I guess. I am going to use one action to hunt my prey mm -hmm. on this guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, hello, you are now hunted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> feels mm -hmm. kind of bad. But uh, I, I, I guess I guess I have to, um, and I will go ahead and strike with my crossbow. Excellent. As you use a ranged attack within melee reach of two skeletal Whoa. champions, they will use their oh. attacks of opportunity, both on you. It's fine. We're all friends down here. See, they can't even hit me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, can I use a hero point to reroll? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <clears throat> uh, reroll using a. That's not better. 
Um, I guess I'm gonna reload, and that's my reload as your third action. Click it. Actually, click. Oh. I'm gonna raise my shield. <laughs> you have a shield and a crossbow. No, wait. You need a hand for your cross. You need a hand for your shield. You need a hand to reload. I have. Oh right. Okay. Well, so I've had my shield this entire time. That's my bad. Then theoretically, you need a free hand to reload or a free hand to have a gotcha. shield. But in that case, I'll just reload and not raise my Perfect. shield. Perfect. Can I undo that? It, yes, you can undo that. If you wanna, if you have like your battle axe and your shield, then that's doable for sure. So you just decide okay. at the start of battle if you wanna battle axe and shield or hand crosser and reload effectively. So hit the reload All macro. All right. So, but will it, it? Okay. There we go. Uh, reload. There we go. That's Perfecto. Tell me. Well, these skeletons are not friendly. He did not respond to her, you know, welcoming uh, invitations and started trying to beat up on some of her favorite party members. So Helmy is just going to walk right in. Mm -hmm. uh, it, to the best of her knowledge, they've used up their attacks of opportunity. So uh, going to move here uh first then gonna move okay this one's gonna swing at you this third yep, one's gonna right. swing at you with its long sword oh my god can't hit where it all right it's and, good uh, now now that it's flanked uh oh that's snack race uh yeah, that's my turn. That's your turn, Cass. Yeah, man. Cool, 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 cool. You know, what I would like from you, Cass, when you get a chance, yep. is to give me a five-second sound effect of your Inspire Courage, and I might be able to hit that yep. every once in a while, you know? The All right. Boom, 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 awesome, boom, boom, awesome. Boom, 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 yeah, yeah, you got it. I love uh, the bonuses hand signs. Oh, I pressed wrong thing, sorry. Uh, here you go. There we go, uh, and I will do a threaten. No, 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 no. Take, I take that back. I take that back. Me <laughs> 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 hey, I... when I slaughter my own people. Let's see here. Let's see here. I will do some cool things. Do some cool things. I'm gonna just gonna electric arc this. Oh, let me check <clears throat> the red ones. These two right here. Cool things indeed. I don't know, little, little bastards. <laughs> hmm. oh, no damage? No damage. Oh. They're resistant. Damn. Six. Yeah, I got a... two, five to electricity. Yeah, yes. I, 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 I could chop myself skeletons. Makes sense. And uh, yeah, that's my turn. Beautiful. The skeletal champion will shamble upwards. Five, ten, strike it as slows, who did strike it really hard earlier. You know what? He'll strike again with his other long sword, I guess. <laughs> Jarden. Okay, Jarden, not having been able to heal yet, is going to stay at range for now, I suppose. Gonna move up, target this guy. I do think we did some kerfuffle here because oh no, you you were you were gonna yo okay, you just use lay on hands. Got it, got it, got it. Perfect. Sorry. Right, we were going to go to the next next room before we actually took a took a break. So great idea. Uh I will cast this one. Perfect. Roll me an attack. He's got lesser cover from you, plus one AC. That will miss, unfortunately. That will miss, and I'm not going to use a hero hero point. So that is my turn. Onovan. Um, Fizzlers got really big. What would happen to Cass and Grim? They'd be shoved aside. Interesting. Everything. Would that provide everyone protection, though? They'd get lesser cover from reach attacks, I guess. I don't know. They'd be a bigger target for them to attack. Hmm. Okay. Um, Oliver is going to... Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll leave that for now. 
Um, I'm going to boost Eidolon, but I'll use extend boost for once. Uh, you want me to click on extend boost. I think it's a um, just click on it really quickly if you would be so kind. I have to roll and do a nature check. Okay, nature, yes. Standard for your level. I'm gonna hate this nat one. That is a critical. Su no, your level is not level quite. Three. Yeah, it's 28. Nope, it's a normal success. It's a three round boost idol on. I Good for me, because that was the free action, wasn't it? It's a free verbal, but it does use a focus point, correct? Yeah. Okay, let yeah. me just double check her boost idol on here, because I could I potentially think it works, like, change it to three rounds right now. There we go. Change three rounds. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so that's Onovan's action. Um, Islos is going to... You know what? She's going to go all out, I think. She's going to Titan Swing this one here. Okay. She's mad. This fight needs to end. Already? But we just started. That's why I don't trust you. You're scary. That is a hit. Oh, roll me damage and then be... go and roll me a uh, backlash, please. Have you done this today in any earlier fights? No. Okay. Skeletons cannot bleed, so it just takes... Um, Aww. It actually is also oh. resistant to slashing as it takes nine damage. Why, I, why does it do slashing? Or whatever the Titan Swing. What is a Titan Swing? Is I think it, it's whatever Titan Swing. Slashing, yeah. Is it? Does, um, My vine is slashing? <clears throat> Interesting. Cass, it makes sense. Yeah. Do you have... Any positive healing spells? Mm, only rain, only touch. So that was that was one action. The, uh, I, I'm gonna change Two the actions. I'm gonna change the branch to bludgeoning, and the vine will be slashing. So you have a little option there. All right, just a heads up. Oh, okay. All right. I'll do the bludgeoning now with the branch. Perfect. On on this one. Perfect. It makes. I, I'm okay with you having different damage types. Ah. We'll miss, unfortunately. Uh, I'm gonna reroll that. Okay. Why does it say reroll using hero point? It doesn't. Because you're using a slow. It's just reroll. You uh, keep the yeah. result and subtract a hero point manually there on it. If it helps, you could theoretically micromanage. Okay. Ah, oh, for God's sake. You could add the same hero points that you have as a slow to uh, on it if that helps. Okay. Uh -huh. Skeletal Temple will turn around and strike twice and raise their shield. Okay, the second one will strike for eight damage on Helmy. This one will go ahead and um, target Islos and Islos or Grim. I think Islos. They're already focused on Islos there. That'll miss. Should I have intimidated? Yeah, they're going to hiss. All right, that's not going to work. And then MAP, Lance, minus five. Nope, I cannot hit today. This one also has a Lance. Or this one has a short... No, this one has a Lance. It's going to continue targeting Cass. It's going to hiss at Cass first. <sighs> What's your will DC, Cass? Yeah, my will DC is 20. <laughs> that will then not succeed. And then we'll then Lance at you twice. Uh-oh. Uh, that's not great. Okay, that, that's not so we're going to do just that 27 for the first that, one. I, that knocks me. As you are crit, you're going to fall unconscious, and it's going to switch its last turn. I'm going to have to reroll, all right, to do a attack on Grim. So I'm going to reroll this one, all right, just because it was against, well... It does I guess the number would have been the same, but that's fine. Mm -hmm. That would be a miss anyway. Grim. Um, can I make him drink one of my potions? If it's an elixir, he'll be fine. You'd be two actions to do that. Two. Okay, I'm gonna use those two actions. Okay, you will take uh, attacks of opportunity if you do this. You know this, right? Fuck. 
Unless you step, oh, yeah. unless you like step back here with your first action. But I'll take them anyway. Step is disengage. That. Step is move five feet and not take attacks of opportunity. But that is an action. Yeah. Yep. So that's up to you. Okay. Can can you just shove Cass back? Can I do that? You can use an oh, action. Oh wait, no, your dog's in the way. I'll do it. No, the dog's here. No, no, here. You can you can use an action I'll to do that. Um, quickly. But I, I, me, get Chuck to bring it back to me. Okay, I'll use an action order Chuck to drag Cass back if that's okay. Okay, so it, theoretically Chuck needs to grab Cass with his first action, then pull him back with his second. So I think that mm -hmm. would be fine. And then Graham, you all still right. have two actions left. Okay. First of all, I would I just want to say if anyone has any positive healing or healing potions, I I think we could use them against these guys. And I am going to second action step. Perfect. And then target that one. And actually, can I target the one I have set prey? Absolutely. Set yeah, prey? he's got a little oh. cover. He's got plus one AC, but you can do that. Yeah, of course. I actually, do it doesn't. Idea. It doesn't um stack with his shield, so you're fine. All right. That hits that because he had his shield raised. He thunk, oh. raises like his shield. Well, not actually raises his shield. Well, he did raise his shield. So his shield blocks the uh, the attack, unfortunately. That's my turn. All right, Helmy. Uh, yeah, we're going to go in and uh, chop. Smackaroni. He's going to use shield block. Roll me uh, damage, and I will block his... This attack, as he uses reaction, to, yeah. Oh, it's also res it applies resistances. Well then, I guess I'm gonna attack again. That will unfortunately miss. And. Uh... I'll just raise my shield this time. Perfect. The skeletal champion will strike at Islos twice. And raise his shield. Okay, Onovan, you take 18 damage. Jarden. <clears throat> okay. Hey, I'm going to... Try something, see if this works. Uh, back in this area is where I'm going to target. It's a 10 foot emanation. Let me know what you're trying to do. Perfect web. I'll place the 10 foot burst. It's got to be here, theoretically, or let me see if I can move it so you can get three of them potentially here. Mm, that would get Islos. Yeah. Do you want to get Islos or um, uh, Helmian or no? I'd rather not. Okay. So it would just be two in that case. Yeah. And that's that's fine. Okay. Uh, uh, when uh, difficult terrain enters the web, be use a move action. You did, do they need to roll at the start? A creature uh, enters the web or. Use a move action. Each time a creature in the web begins use a move action or enters or enters the web. Okay, so right now they do not roll anything. All right. Uh, okay. So that's two actions. That's a three action spell. Got it. It got is. It, yep. Got it. Got it. Onovan. Don't they enter the web when they the web is created? Mm, I would say no, because it specifically okay. says enters the web during a move action. <laughs> Oh. Or moved while they're already in it, yeah. yeah. Okay, um, I'm going to Battle Medicine cast. Sorry in advance that this is going to be bad. This is not good. Hey! No, no, hey. Oh, I'll sh I should have done the thing. Would you Sorry. be so kind as to use the macro and then I will I'll just take this roll, but like use the macro so I can yeah, apply yeah. the immunity on him. That'd be great. All right, don't worry. Yeah, apply balance of anything. Roll me 2d8, please. 
Sorry. That's 13 healing on cast. I'll do better. Thank you. How is that bad, my dude? <laughs> no, I mean, because I'm like rolling the wrong things. I'll oh, it's, learn, it's okay. I promise. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, and then I'm going to use battle medicine on myself. Are you not immune? Well done. Yes. Do the thing. Hey! Pew, pew, pew. Oh, that's not a crit. Oh, I did it again. Oh, fuck. Okay. I just said I'd do better. <laughs> Choose the microphone. Fucking, I lied. I lied to you. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same. <laughs> well, oh, come no. on. No. Oh, you get a... But I get plus five. Yeah. Oh, that's eight. That's good. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, so that's two actions. Uh, then his loss is going to... I don't know about you, Helmy, but uh, seems to me you and I are off. And now oh, the trade's not that okay. Who cares? But, uh, <laughs> fucking rip. <laughs> oh, shit. <sighs> I mean, oh, come on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for that one again. Come on, not 20. Not bad. That'll hit. Oh, that'll do. Has this guy used shield block yet? He has. That, shit, that should have been Titan Swing. Sorry. That shouldn't have been. So just reroll damage no. for me. Reroll damage for me, uh, please. Sorry. Without Titan Swing. Oh, God. All right, at least he takes seven and he's looking really bad. Yeah. So. Yeah. Barely holding on together. Is that your turn, Onovan? Yeah. Sorry. That's okay. The skeletal champion will target Helmy and strike. Okay. I feel better then. Uh, yeah, I'll take the damage. You will take the damage. He will strike one more time. He's already facing you. Ooh, that's an at one. And then we'll raise his shield. I should the have sword been... breaks. Is that, uh, <laughs> is that like, <laughs> yes, the great, the best DMs do that. Sword breaks on a natural one. Get fucked, Marshals. Mm -hmm. uh, the skeleton champion will try to intimidate. Have I already tried to intimidate you, Islos? Yeah. Okay. You did not. I don't believe anyone's tried to intimidate Helming. That's We've all played Minecraft. Bone meal is good for plant. That's okay. Um, I'm. <laughs> do you say that? So <laughs> I have tried to intimidate you, Islos. Is that a yes? Yes, I have. Okay. So I'm intimidate Helming. Oh, that's a frightened one. No, uh, it would be. Oh, get fucked. <laughs> <laughs> get fucked, skeletal champion. All right, he's going to strike at you with a lance twice. Oh, that's a, oh, that's a hit. I thought it was a miss. Okay, that'll deal 12 damage. Uh, that one I am going to block, actually. Okay, I will give you back the health, and I'll do the block version of this. That's such a good... What? Bravery is sick. You go, Helmy. Your shield is damaged for seven. Yeah, no. it hits a steel shield. Mm -hmm. It'll hold up a little more. Helmy's amazing. Oh, thank you. Cass. Yep. Yeah, I got you. You're up. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank you. Oh, my God. That hurt. Oh, my God. I didn't even see that coming. Oh, no. I'm going to stand back up. Oh, my God. Oh. You stand up as an action. Yeah, and I will uh, I'll cast uh, telekinetic projection on this one. Perfect. I'm assuming a bludgeoning. Yes, boo. All right, which one exactly are you targeting? Uh, yeah, he's targeting got, I, one, I, right? he would have. Uh, can you see him? I guess. Uh, I can see him. I can fully okay. see him. He would have standard cover from your angle, right? Uh, the spell doesn't have to start from my area. It could start from within, with like with a skull or something. Um, Would not change anything. Um, that's an interesting interpretation of doing that. Yeah. Uh, that that's how I have understood it, but I, I could be wrong. Uh, yeah, let me just say telekinetic. You hold a loose on a teleprojector that's within the range, and that's one bulk or less. Um, uh, so you, there course. is there is a lacking any hard rules. It doesn't avoid cover. Harder to see and aim. Harder to detect. Okay. There is there's some people that are arguing this, and I think it's it's we're just gonna apply cover mechanically as per every other uh, range yep. spell. All right. Yeah, yeah, Sorry. that's uh, yeah. yep, all good. Yep. Now let me roll. There you go. 
That <laughs> still hits. It. Yeah, excellent. Roll me damage. Go right. and, the, and that is dead. It is. Oh wait, he had a shield. He had a shield race. Hold on, hold on. Oh. Let me get back eight, eight HP, and we're gonna do shield block with that. It's. Wait. Uh, no damage. Wait, what? That's a strong shield. <laughs> no, no, no. Shield block yeah. should. Yeah. Why is he taking no damage? Uh, try click on the shield block and yeah. on and off. It says it's already <laughs> dead. Maybe. Oh, maybe it's because. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you targeting? Uh, hold on. Let me let me try again. Uh, block damage. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Let me give it. It's got eight HP. Let me just do damage. No damage. Skeletal champion, you have health. I believe in you. Come on. No, oh, it's because he's dead mechanically. All right. Let's try again. He will block with a reaction. Shield is dead. Okay. He's still alive as he <coughs> tries to block mm -hmm. it. Uh, Damn. Was, yeah. Sorry, but he is it's barely good. standing. Yeah. Oh, by the way, the cover would have actually not mattered at all because it doesn't stack with the shield. So there you go. All right. Yep. But in terms awesome. of in terms of like in game, like trying to figure that out, you're you, he's still hidden, so you have to like kind of find him and stuff, kind of thing. Yeah. You know? So not hidden, hidden, but you know what I'm saying. All right, Cass. Mm -hmm. That's your turn. That's my turn. I one action to stand up, two actions to cast spell. Beautiful. The skeletal champion will attempt to move out of the web. Does he need to roll if he attempts to move out of the web? Yes. Excellent. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, hit the but hit the web thing again for me, please. Without casting, you just click on the icon. Alrighty. Boink. I'm gonna roll the reflex save, and then I'm gonna see what happens here as he tries to move out of the web. Uh, he is stuck. He is immobilized. No. Uh, sorry. Failure is a minus ten foot penalty to his speed. Is he? Oh right. Yep. Yeah, so he has got he's got a little less speed as he rips himself out for one action. Yeah, I think he would just move there and then target Grim. Have I tried to intimidate you, Grim? Yes, I have. With this one in particular, I I need it. There needs to be some sort of automation to figure out who's intimidating who. Grim, have I intimidated you with this guy yet? I don't think so. Okay, let's do that. Your will DC is 18. That meets it, beats it. You are frightened one. I'm not scared of you. Only a little. <laughs> well, that was just weird. Oh, no. Ouch. Because of frightened one, that is a critical hit. Modifiers Ouch. matter. Grim. Yep. Uh, Chuck, go. <laughs> I'm gonna send in Chuck. He's uh, so. Can I just command him to attack this one? Yes, you can move one action and attack with a second. Dogs do love a bone. I love bones. That funny. Uh, um. So strike. There we go. Yeah, I have a question for you. Hell yeah. I have a question for you. Chuck yeah. is what? Is he a beastmaster pet? I think so, yeah. Okay, then we 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 made a mistake on his stat block because he needs to have oh. better stats than this. I might do this in oh, the break. I mean, his attack is already very strong. No, no, I know, but he would he would actually require. I don't know why I gave you this stat block when I did this. I don't remember why I did this, but I'm pretty sure. Let me double check here. Is he from? You got him a level two, right? I think so. Yeah. And, oh no, it's animal companion. No, is that's it? Reaper. No, that's Reaper. Oh, Beastmaster Education. Um, you call companion action. Okay, just uh, just out of curiosity, it is a Beastmaster pet, right? Like you have a path builder. Yeah. Okay, can we meet like before next session again, Joy, and set set up? Mix Chuck? it up. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be yeah, great. It's all right. We'll all accept a hundred gold pieces each. That's fine. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, that'll work too. For now, just roll me damage on Chuck, please. I yeah. He will take three damage as he's All resistant right. to piercing. All right. And then I am going to reload. Mm -hmm. He will take an attack and of opportunity on you. Shit, I'm going to die. As you use a manipulate <laughs> action within his reach. Again. That'll oh, miss. never mind. Nice. And then, shit, but if I attack, this is bullshit. 
No, he's, he's gonna, already he's used his. He's already used his reaction. It's a oh, reaction. All right. yeah. So you normally can't... only all right. really strong enemies have more than one attack of opportunity. There's a so there's me. like a, the thousand hand god or something that has a thousand reactions. It's great. Roll me damage. I don't know what it's called. Yeah, maybe maybe I'll buy like a good one. Like CR24 or something Mm. I've seen like that. It'll deal no damage as he's resistant to piercing. But doesn't it just get halved when it's resistant? Not in Pathfinder. Nah. Damn, I hate Pathfinder. I suck. Uh, I should have min maxed. <laughs> you, you can, yeah, okay. All right, we'll, 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 we'll talk tactics. Help me, help me, help me, help me, help me, help me, help me. Help me. If only we knew what hurt undead. Help is getting mad at their uh, resistances. Mm-hmm. So Help is going to change the game. Just say Help me. Get a hero point. Just going to keep talking in for a person now. Yeah. Drop. She's going to drop her sword. Okay. Free action. And she's going to take a big old swing at this guy. Ooh. Almost a crit. He tries to block it and defend himself with a shield, but it's too late. He's dead. Can he, can he even shield block right now? Yeah, I don't think it, ma- it matters. He had 3H. Maybe. Hold on. Hold on. Hold Maybe on. two, isn't it? Hold so if on. it blocks five. Yeah. <sighs> ah! I'm sorry, help hey. me. I'm sorry. He's going to shield block with his reaction, taking two damage, leaving at one HP. I guess I'm going to punch him again. If at first you don't exceed, all right, that'll crunch him to dust. Well done, Helmy. Hell yeah. All right. Nice. And uh, then I will uh, step here. I'm not trying to rules or anything. I'm, I just don't know the rules. Mm-hmm. I, I thought punches were like non lethal. How does that work when something's undead? When it's undead, they cannot be, they don't, they're immune to non lethal. They just die. Oh, okay. They, cool. they, they would just straight up die. Wow. Except, so something nice. except to... PC characters, if there were oh, to be any, we in, don't this, have any of those. in this group. Yeah. Help me, that's yeah. your turn. <laughs> yeah. I'm human, guys. The skeletal champion will target Islos. I've, uh, I think I've already demoralized you like 20 times at this point, so I'm just going to smack. I, I'm just surprised that Islos is Ooh. still alive by this point, you know? Yeah, Islos is fucking... Oh, Dang it so breaks. Why? <laughs> Jordan. Because we keep a rolling world on it. Do you want me to use crit fail charts? I will use crit fail uh, charts. Uh, no. Yeah. I have a crit fail chart. <laughs> only for the enemies. That's no, okay. And a crit yeah, success chart. So is the is the web sustained or it, it just stays there for one minute, right? I don't have to su- sustain it? Uh, if it says sustain, you have to spend an action to sustain it. All right, let me look back up here. No, it doesn't say. It doesn't say sustain, so it it's not one. sustain. Okay. One thing I want to mention: this is the f- very rarely this comes up, but this spell is a material component, which means you need a hands free to touch your arcane focus. If you have right. your staff in one hand, then it's fine. Just for future right. reference, yeah. Okay, Roger that. Um, <clears throat> boy, I could use that spell slot, or you know what? No. I'm getting pissed, so I'm gonna move up <clears throat> here. I'm gonna oh, target sorry. that guy, and I will. I'm gonna. Oh, you will take in a. No, you won't. Never mind. You're good. No, no, like ignore me. Ignore me. Yeah. Which one are you targeting? Oh, that one. Nice. The one. The one closest. Yeah. I get rid of this cover. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna do. No, I'll just do gouging claw. I've got this one down there as well. Oh, I didn't even see that one. That'll hit. Well done. The resistances are combined for this. So this is bludgeoning, which actually does full damage. So that's fine. And then the Gaussian Claw will deal two damage. Yes? I think that's fair. I think that's how it works. Yeah. Perfect. Is that your turn, Jordan? That is my turn. On a van. Okay. Um... 
I'm going to have his last strike at the near death dead one. I'm just going to shield block it already, but give it a shot. If you hit. Now, use this reaction to stop its sword breaking. I thought that was. Well, I, I can enable the. You know, I'm going to do it. I'm going to enable the. Uh, no, no, stop. Go <laughs> away. All right. Wait, was there a 20? I, oh, no, that, that was a 20 on the. Okay, I'm going to. Okay, even block if you block them. that, it's dead, right? Right? It takes two damage and dies. Yeah. Just like me. Uh, so that's one action. Second action. Uh, I'll start uh, nuts and bolts. What does grapple like? Okay, so my vine has grapple on it and trip. What does what does that do? Uh, Just means I can it. use them to grapple or trip. You yeah. can use the weapon uh, modifier to. Okay. Instead of doing doing damage. Okay. But if my weapon modifier and my athletics modifier are the same, it's kind of whatever. Well, kind of it, it does mean that you don't have to worry if, for example, your hands are full, like mine normally are. Oh, uh, okay. I can't yeah. grapple or trip because my weapon doesn't have grapple. And when his loss gets like proper reach eventually, it'll mean I can reach it with a range or whatever? Yes. Okay. Uh, second action, I'm going to... Uh. Uh, I'll hit the one that everyone's hitting. Uh, I'm gonna help help me in a second though. Okay, uh, I'll do branch again. Come on. Okay. Uh, what can I do? Um, I'm going to uh, use my spinner tail. On Onovan to uh, make Helmy and uh, this one the hero and villain. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. What's the tale? Tell um, me, tell me. I want to hear it. Helmy, you're all alone, but uh, come on, we've got to get back home. Uh, don't despair. We're all here. Best in bloom, have no fear. There you go. He rhymed. That that makes it good. Uh, and point. then Oh shit, thanks. What the what do I do with my last action? Uh You that's it, right? You attack Oh no, you, no. Yeah, yeah, one more action, yeah. Two of these lost and one with Onovan. Uh I'm gonna give Cass uh guidance. You Keep playing that tune, Cass. I will Okay, that's the end of my turn. Yay! Skeletal Champion will attack Eslos as he are flanked. No! Flankeroni, and I think he should demoralize as well. Ah, oh, he cool. should have demoralized for a crit! Ah! <laughs> Too bad. Well, he's gonna do that now. It's no. not, not too late, right? To hiss, no. hiss at you, Eslos. Nah. It is. Wouldn't no, have done it. Talk. Wouldn't have done it, and then he's gonna MAP attack. It's loss. No. Mess. Ah. Cass. Oh, I'm not feeling so good. I am uh, gonna start with my, uh, my usual thing of uh, inspire courage. Bum, 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 bum. I got some sound effects, maybe. What do we got? What do we got? Uh, uh. Why do I have two chicken sound effects? What's wrong with me? All right, anyway. I'll uh, check at the one here. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> anyway. So I'm gonna take a projectile. I can't actually, no man. All right, hit the, hit the attack for me, por favor. We are pointing that. We are pointing it. We did it. We did it! Oh! Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm gonna attack Islos. Yep. You're flanked, Islos. <laughs> no. I'm gonna hiss I'm at so you. I'm gonna hiss at you I'm first. Sad. No, you're not. No? No. No. Yes, That's a successful hiss for a frightened one. Guys, kill these skeletons, please. 
That'd be great. You know, that would be like amazing. You know, Pablo, you could do it for us. No, I'm but a tool to be used. No. <gasps> yeah, you are a tool. Now do it, Pablo. Bonavent, I'm paying no. you. You take five damage, putting you unconscious. Islas is gone. Islas is gone. Grim. Chuck, go. But I can't do any damage. I'm not stealth blocks not built yet. Shit. I have strength plus ten. I can do it. All right, right? All right. do the thing. Do the thing. It's whatever. Yeah. yeah, do it, buddy. If he strikes, do I get MAP? No. Okay. Uh, damage, right? Yes, sir. And you can actually, like because we're using the old damage. stat block, Damn. we could theoretically use knockdown if you want as just a free. Yes. So he's just going to knock him prone. You want to do that? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Let's do it. Get fucked. He's prone. So, um, but now I get disadvantage on my attack. No, you don't. No, no? you don't. It's okay. not Pathfinder. No. You get a minus two AC on him, which is good for you. Oh, so that makes it easier for me. It does indeed. Yes. All right, I'll use action to reload, and then last. He's gonna use his attack of opportunity. Damn it! <laughs> Have you not learned your lesson, old man? I hate my own oh, race. Dear. <laughs> <gasps> oh, that's smart. Okay. Have you not learned your lesson? All right. I've still got seven HP. It's fine, and then I'm gonna bow attack him because he no longer has a reaction. Right. Yep. Right. Yep. He just Follow. used it. He just used it. He just, you know, just making sure. I don't want to do an oopsie. Goes yeah. right hey, through. And you have room. a hero point. <laughs> I guess not. That's my turn. That's okay, Graham. I'm gonna give you a pity hero point after this battle. Yes. What are you doing, yeah. Helmy? Uh, Helmy is enraged at this point, uh, and is going to drop her shield. No. Oh. And mm -hmm. it's going to grapple the skeleton. <laughs> oh no, that'll fail. It's against their then fortitude. She's yeah. going to use her secret hero points. Oh, <laughs> fuck. Uh, I guess she'll just attempt to grapple again with MAP. Okay. The fortitude's uh, not that great. It's, you know... Well... You Just subtract four from this, I guess. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> nice. I, I wanted to mention, Helmy, I did give you another hero point earlier. You forgot to add it. You should have been at three. All right? I'm not cheating. Uh, I, you can wait. watch the recording. You should have been what at three. Would a 17 have worked? Yeah. They're oh, I'm so dumb. The villain of my folktale. Wait, the folktale is being added, isn't it? No, I don't think it is. I put the status on you. What does Spin tell you? I didn't, I didn't check it. Is that an attack roll? Well, I guess it is. I guess it's it an is. attack roll. Okay. Well, go ahead and add, you know, go ahead and add two hero points. One for the one I gave you earlier. I promise you can watch the recording. You just don't listen, guys. You need to add those hero points when I give them to you. <laughs> and then... With a 17, it's just because of the tail that's being spun. I need some role play. I need a little bit of just heroic. What does Onovan say? And how do you grapple him with the tail? Uh, the villainous skeleton and his evil partner have knocked down two of Helmy's comrades. But, you know, no, you know, uh, what the shit? What were they called? The, the skeletons in Skyrim. What were they called? Draugr. Uh, yeah, Draugr. No, no fucking Draugr is going to, you know, best uh, Helmy and her comrades. Uh, and the, their deaths are going to be much more special than that. And then she's gonna punch. You grab him. Yep. Yeah. You punch him. Good lord. That would hit with the tail, but that I think it's a status bonus as well, right? So it doesn't it stack is. when it's back courage. Got it. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, uh, that's it. Yeah, one more action. Well, go for broke, I guess. Yeah, no. Perfect. At least he's grabbed. At least he is grabbed. Jarden. Okay, well, because my last action was a spell strike, I am going to enter Arcane Cascade. Beautiful. Uh, and I did... What did I do? I did piercing, right? Yeah. 
Um, and then as a free action, because I'm in Cascade, I'm going to switch my grip to two hands. And Is that a manipulated guy... action? Uh, you know, no, that's a good question, actually. Is that a good, a good point? As you switch your that, grip, I don't know. The skeleton champion here, who has yet to use his reaction, will strike. It is manipulated. It says it uh, okay. in multiple places. He will All strike right. at you, Jarden. I'm sorry. These things suck. That's okay. All right. Hey. Hey, it what's wrong, with skeletons? <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, I will still attack this guy. And nice. Crit. Oh, beautiful. Roll me critical. <laughs> it's, wow. It's, all good. It's, it's, it's <laughs> still dead. <laughs> Splatters to a thousand and bones. And then with my last action using a reek uh, against this one, uh, I am going to. Try to trip him, MAP. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's already grappled. There's no point in tripping him. Oh, I thought you weren't able to, to grapple him. No, he did. He managed to grapple them. Yeah, you could. If you oh. trip him, he won't be able to get up theoretically. If 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 you fair point. Yeah. Um. No. In in that case, I will just MAP strike him. Him. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Ooh, I yep. saw that twenty. I did too. <laughs> yeah, Jordan, that's your turn. Um, yeah, oh, I stand by. I still have how many hit hero points? I have two. So I'll, okay, I'll, I'll okay. reroll using hero point. Yeah, go ahead. Well, wow, not much better. <laughs> Hold on, I got a All sound right. effect for this. Maybe. Wah, wah, wah. All right. The skeletal champion will try to retaliate on Helmy. I'm gonna flavor, not even flavor. It's just it's too awkward for him to use a lance on you. So he's just gonna claw at you, Helmy. Like scratching against your armor. He's gonna do it again. Oh! As he rips into it and just starts tearing into your chest. The last thing he's gonna do is I guess MAP it's not worth it at all but I I don't can't think of anything else Cass what are you doing all right I'm gonna be uh, the support man that I am I'm gonna first gonna focus spell uh, lay hands on Onovan mm -hmm. <gasps> thank you no problem oh you had two I'm assuming yes Cass uh, uh yeah I had two I'm down to one focus okay. point. I have a full pool. I can only weaken one, though. Uh, did you uh, use... Uh, just not to be meditative about it, but did you use Inspire? Oh, you have three. Okay, okay. I have three. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have three total. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Yep, yep. Uh, and then I will uh, I will cast uh, a first level heal on Helmy as well. She could be in for a beating. So. It's okay. Oh. I get hit a lot. Yeah, just uh, making sure you don't go down from getting hit. So let me roll that. Will be a bit of healing as well. Oh, it's a bad roll. Seven hit points. Oh, uh, let me. Better hit. than nothing. Mm -hmm. And uh, yep, that's reactions. Onovan. <gasps> oh, welcome back. Okay, okay Onovan. I can't see double a tingle something. Let me get rid of your dying condition. Yeah, yeah, your dying is a bit wonky in the game. I've noticed. Just so you know. Yeah, it might be the experimental features I've enabled potentially. Let me yeah, get rid of, let me get rid of those. I mean, yeah, yeah, the, two. yeah, it increases dying way too much at least. PF two E workbench manage client automation settings. No, it's manage world automation settings. Um, no, it's off. It's off. I'm not sure why it's doing that. Um, add one more dying if critically damaged. I don't know. I'll double check later. Anyway, you, you stand up as an act. What do you do, Onovan? Sorry. Uh, Onovan, I've got d wounded too, by the way, for some reason. You have you, <laughs> have you have you fallen twice so far or no? <laughs> uh, against the monkeys, I guess. So yeah, maybe it's the same. Is that the same? Yeah, but I was fully healed you by that from point. The monkeys. We would have treated your wound on the gondola and no other time. Yeah. Okay. That's mm -hmm. good. That's fine. You got wounded one then. Uh, 
Sorry, I didn't mean to move. I'm not trying to move. Um, I'm going to use... Is there only this one there, Grim? I just ask. Uh, pointing to yeah, the one I that I can see. I think it's just that one. Right. Uh, uh, I'm going to... And we can't even flank it. Uh, I'm going to use... Do I use heal on it? Is that going to give 30 feet? Would the two action one give, do like at least eight, or is it just plus eight to the hit points it restores? I think it's eight. Um, double checking. Undead, it says specifically, I'll just click on it for you right now. You deal the amount of positive damage and gets a fortitude save, which is just 1d8. It's a basic save, though. Okay. So it could crit, fail, and double it. Hmm. Should I should I use my last bit of magic on this to try and kill it, or should I save it for us? Uh, I think I will be able to take care of it, but if you really want to... I mean... Hmm. You can try, I suppose. Helmi and me and Jardin are all looking very beat up, as well as... Okay. You could do actually uh, three action, right? Is that what you're, is that what you're going to try to do, actually, anyway? I mean, I could, but the issue is um, we've got... An undead party member. Oh, it's Lord. okay. Lord. You can risk it. You can do it for me. Oh no! Uh, do it. Okay. Uh, if it, if if I know that it would get Helmy around the corner, then I'll do it. The yeah. three action I'm, heal. I'm okay with it, just because it's cool and I've never had this happen before. So fuck it. Do it. Do the three action heal. Do it. Hit three action. All right, here's what we're going to do. Hit the healing. Me? Yeah, hit the healing button, please. All right, that's... Oh, decent. that's good healing as well. Helmy, Jarden, and Cass, and Onovan will heal for seven. Uh, Grim and the Skeletal Champion need to hit that Fortitude Saving Throw button in chat once it stops scrolling. Oh, it's scrolling for me, yeah. I'm gonna try. Oliver's gonna try and do his best to not hurt um, Grim using a hero point for on Grim's behalf to have Grim re-roll that. Grim okay. re-roll using just re-roll and keep the new result. It's manually subtract a hero I'm point from me. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, success. that is a success. Nice, Grim. You will take half damage. Right. I'm sorry, Grim. I would it's like. Okay. I would like a description. From you, Onovan, for a plus for a minus one circumstance penalty on a skeletal champion. Okay. Uh Onovan reaches out, like having Islos kind of like fallen, but Islos is never far from Onovan. And so um instead of summoning Islos, he summons like part of the life force of Islos that connects him. And through the mark on the back of his neck, uh, begins to channel this positive energy outside of him. This vivacious gnome, because I'm specifically that type, taps into that part of his being as well and just pushes it outwards. As he does this, the, the wellspring of magic kind of like cascades over his allies. He desperately tries to curl it around um, Grim and using the momentum of like that curl, basically like weave it to hit the the skeleton even harder i love it thank you so much he will take 14 damage from that as he critically Hell failed. yeah well good description out of him thank you so much thank you. that is your turn grim they're not weak to it that fucking sucks <laughs> thank you I for the, like, the crit then <laughs> i feel like my bones sort of crumbling but I, I push on as I'm going to turn around. And can I hit him from here if I had... If he I has standard the cover from that Okay. Angle. Plus two AC. So, plus two, okay. But he's flat-footed because oh. Helmy grabbed him. So he's got just normal AC, essentially. Okay. Hunt him? You can hunt him as an action. Mm -hmm. First action hunt. Uh, you cannot use... Oh, not targeted. One sec. Uh, oh, don't need to know that. I want to do this. Hunt prey, one action. All right, and then reload. Yes. Uh, not enough ammunition. What? 
Are you out oh, of I bolts? Oh, I gotta switch it out. Nah, I've got bolts. I just need to switch which one. Oh, no, I am out of bolts. Fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, we can assume you bought bolts in town. I'm okay. Yeah, I probably How many, how many would you have bought? Just 20, I think. Just to buy back what I've lost more? now. more? I'll give you 20 more and subtract two silver. It's okay. You are a blessing. Uh, okay, can you subtract the silver for me? I have. All right. Uh, okay, in that case, reload. Target. And here we go. Come on. Actually. I know Chuck does more damage than my bow. So I'm going to send Chuck in. Okay. Even though. Yeah. Give me free There's bones. Some... Chuck is going to run in and go for this strike plus nine. That's that not great. Hits. Because Elmi Still has him Jesus, he is damage. a monster. I will roll damage. Nice, Elmi. I, I gotta redo the stat block, but for now, it, it will take five damage. He's resistant, five piercing. Yes? Yes. Nice. That's Still your... near death. That's my turn. That's your turn, Elmi. Elmi, Tell me, do it. Get Trey, it. come back. Trey said to use Titan Swing on his behalf, so I'm gonna steal yeah. his thunder. Or when he comes back, I I was the one who made the kill. Okay. I, I hear a squeaky door. I do too. No, you don't. Trey, I hear a squeaky door. Oh, oh, his mic's Trey, up. Dos, Uno, <laughs> do you get it? Because. Um... Uh, so sorry. No, you don't get a villain point. No, <laughs> stop. So sorry. <laughs> All right, Trey, it's your turn. I was about to click on Titan Swing and an armor Finish stack, him. but you do it for me, please. Finish him. Go on, help me. Yep. Roll me damage and Finish him. how do you want to do this, Trey? Nice. Yes. I mean, it's a Titan Swing, I guess. Uh, roll backlash, but. My, well. you know, fist will get real big, and I'll, I'll basically just go full anime, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. As he gets crumpled into pieces, roll me 1d20, we'll end the combat at this point. Oh! No backlash. Next DC is 10. Move the time 5 minutes so we can get rid of that web. Oh no, the web doesn't yeah. get it automatically. There we go. Yeah. Web is not as good as I thought I thought it was. Unfortunate, yeah. but you can't you are a prepared caster, right? You can't switch them around at the start of the day. So Right. Yep. So the skeletal champions are dead. You will find some loot. Uh, that was horrible. I Grim, are you okay? Fine. I'll make it. I still think you're too skinny. You're not gonna survive the winter. Well, good thing oh, there is no winter sad. in space. I think. Well, I'm hoping we get back before it's winter time. Do you love the winter that much? No horses or? Winter's <laughs> great. Yeah, it's, you know, cold and everything kind of freezes over. And, you know, where we live, the, you don't really get sun most of the day. But, is Christmas uh, a thing in Galarian? Sorry? Or something. Is there a thing similar to Christmas in Galarian? Mm, there are certainly holidays. Uh, for the uh, Grim, one of them had a crossbow in here. Sorry, carry on, try for the for the elfin people in my village, though. You know, it's really just an excuse to spend all day either, uh, you know, drinking, reading, or making love. Oh, There's really not much else you can do during the winter. Well, uh, I, I, I'm not really uh, a fan of all those things that they do, but uh. Maybe one day after we all finish this, I will come along and see about this drinking. I mean, I'm going to be yeah. honest. If you don't do none of those things, it kind of sucks. But if Well, you do then, I, things... then I'll come along and start trying new things, I guess. Um, People do get I... real adventurous during that season. I'll kind of just stare at the fallen corpses scattered uh, among Anavan, the already. What did bones. you say? Sorry? There's a, one of these ones has a crossbow, Grim, and uh, there's a longsword, Helmy, and uh, there's a lance, and... Uh... Dibs on the crossbows. 
Well, I don't care that we killed these guys. Now I have a plus one crossbow. Let's go. Actually, um, Grim, it's a plus one striking crossbow. Actually, striking means you double the damage. Extra dice. die damage, yeah. Oh, I like that. I like that even more. So I get double, double. I will take it. It is. How do I take it? You can drag and drop it from the Skeletal Champion's loot to your inventory. All right. Uh, thank you for calling this out, Arno. And, uh, uh, I, I assume everyone else is okay with that. It makes sense, right, folks? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Anyone, absolutely. I mean, if anyone wants a crossbow, you can have my old one. Maybe it will help some people. It's not. Oh, no, I've, I've seen how useless yours is. Don't worry. It's not a wow. hand crossbow, Grim, but a striking crossbow. Do me a favor and just roll damage on the striking crossbow. Equip it and roll damage just for fun. <laughs> Okay, I will. Actually, there's even bolts in roll, here. Oh, too. you need to drop. You need to hold it two-handed this one. Right? You do, but you are already reloading with one of the hands anyway. Do me a favor, click on critical for me, actually, just to oh, see I what. Oh, I clicked on damage, okay. but let's do critical. Let's as click well. on critical. Damn, so... I love this already. That's so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So the <laughs> striking weapons are great, and uh, you just got your first striking weapon, Grim. Congratulations! Woo! Just perfect. <laughs> All right, we're gonna As be kind of hold my side. I'm assuming you guys at this point want to spend 10, 20, or even 30 minutes healing up. Hell Maybe yeah. 30 yes. minutes. Oh, Cast, thank you again. I, I'm no so problem, glad you got no. each other's back. Yeah, you got me, I got you, you know? It's a, it's a right. problem, though. You're all the best people that I could hope to be on this uh, strange adventure with. Well, now, thank you, Anavan. It's been great fun being here with y'all. Though, I gotta say, if we went all the way to an alien planet, why come the we're still in a dungeon fighting skeletons? Ah! <laughs> Maybe these aren't actually the skeletons. Maybe these are just, like, the exoskeletons of ghosts or something. Well, see, now that would be cool, but, you know, it, it sure don't come across that way. Uh, thank you, thank you. I was waiting for someone. <laughs> oh, oh. My god, that's hilarious. That's true. I just realized that. Um, while you're talking, please do the the treat wound stuff, and you know, uh, I'll make ten. Can minutes. I do it, or am I still immune? You are not immune. Yeah, you are. You are immune for thirty more minutes, Grim. Unfortunately, Shit. um, Reaper is also. I will immune. drink one of my elixirs. Okay, I'll heal you for full six. In that case, and use you the remove the one. Go ahead and remove it for me, please. Um, okay. Jarden attempts to treat his own wounds for six, and I will give you the treat wounds immunity, Jarden. Ana, who are you treating? Myself for the first lot. Mm -hmm. I'll try. I oh, can't treat wounds without healer tools or a plaster. Mate, what are you on about? Have you select Donovan and not Islos? I don't know what you're on about. You're a liar. <laughs> All right, that'll roll the 14 and apply treat wounds immunity to yourself 10 minutes pass in the meantime i would like secret uh, perception check from cass no magic from jardin cass you notice a secret tunnel oh all right in the meantime also help me yeah. help me what are you doing for 10 minutes honestly you help me still mostly complaining we went to this alien planet, you know, I was, before, we, <laughs> before we accidentally cursed that lady, she was telling me that the other people who live here, there are these half-naked warrior women who ride dinosaurs, and that sounds like fun. I want to Wait, what? Oh, yeah, they called them the last Lash... Shitters? Lashuntas? Shitters? <laughs> Leshy? I know about no, Leshy. No, 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 not them plant people, the... Uh, Right, don't be so dismissive. His loss is right there. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Is this also Leshy? I was never quite sure. No, I, I'm Peter just a plant person. Out. It's all right, uh, Helmy. But yeah, I mean, you know, when we got we got attacked by that cool snail thing, like yeah, I almost died, and I showed everyone my gumbo pot, which was not great. I wish I hadn't done that. Uh, but. Uh, <laughs> But at least that oh, you're cool, you know? Your feathery birds. He might have just mistaken you for birds. Do they even have birds here? We've not seen any birds yet, I they don't think. seen no birds. I want to see what kind of birds they got here. Yeah, what like, feathers do they have? Maybe it's just all here. scales and bones. We're here fighting skeletons in this cave that smells like farts. We could have done that back home. Oh, my God. Um, too bad you have three hero points, Helmy. 
Um, g- I'll you give, give one, one to me. I'll give one to Grim. A pity hero point. I promise you, one Grim. So, um, I'm just walking around and grabbing some of the bones and putting them in for in ten minutes. Hand. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got yeah. it. We, we no have one. two rests or two, two short two ten minutes, right? Potentially, oh. yes. Um, did you want to refocus, Cass? Or was one of yeah, those? Yeah, okay. first, first oh. 10 minutes I'm refocusing. Okay, yeah, you refocus for the first 10 minutes. That's fine. That's as much as you Help can me. refocus. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, all of them. How's your shield looking? I, I got a spare one if you need. You're up there more. Maybe you should have the nice new one, and I, I'll take your uh, slightly It's a little used beat one. up, but I'm, I can take a look at it, and maybe I can fix it up a little. Did you have no, a repair just, just kit? Just take mine. Curiosity? You I do? Do, do you want to spend 10 minutes repairing your shield? I do, and I think I'll use my hero point, because I'm pretty sure I need a 15. Okay. So, well, do you want mind if I take these bolts? You need a 14, but you can roll after. Oh, you did roll already. You need a fourteen, actually. Oh, so my first one would have worked. Yeah, first one would have worked. Yeah. Um. So that's your oh. pair. Yeah. For for the shield. Oh, give it me back then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can repair the shield. Let's put it at twenty HP. There we go. And then um uh okay all right all right all right one at a time. Yeah, you. I appreciate the offer, Anovan, but you know I, I ain't as good with magic and stuff as y'all are. But I know how to fix the shield. You can take okay. the janky skeleton shield back if you want it. Uh, no, that was just mine anyway. That's so rude. Oh, oh, that was yours already? <laughs> Black armor looks just like the janky skeleton shield. It's just what from my you? olden days. It's All right. Ten from the war. Ten more minutes. Uh, do more things, please. Um, yep. Lay on hands and then refocusing for ten more minutes. You lay on myself. hands and refocus. So I'll heal for uh, twelve. I'm getting more bones. I'm gonna oh, heal is lost. Put me in max and I'm moving my wounded. Yeah. Got this feeling in my bones. Indeed, hey. you're really wounded. <laughs> hey. hey, who are you healing? Hell me. Is lost. Oh. So not help me. Oh, well. oh. I'll Jordan will Jordan will heal heal me for the next ten ten minutes for the, nice. the ten minutes. I was gonna say poor poor help me. All the complaining. Uh, is mm-hmm. Or at least I will try. Let's see. Oh, Boom! You want to hero point <laughs> that is terrible. Me? I am going to definitely use my hero point for that. But just do the macro again and manually subtract your hero point, please. Do the macro again. All right. You need... Okay, hang on. Thank you. Thank you. Don't roll another one, please. Way better! Mm. Way better! Right. Can right, can is lost trying to help to make it a correct? Because I did say that I was helping. Yeah, Isla's. all good. You did say. Oh that. yeah. Roll me a medicine. Yeah. I'll lower the DC to thirteen, just because it's an eight action. Twenty three. Twenty three. Twenty three. Oh! Roll me another two D eight, Jordan. Another two D eight. <laughs> That's a ten. Is lost the help though? Ooh. I'm happy that happened. Uh, how nice. Oh, that was a real good job, Jordan. At first, I was worried you were just going to stab me a little bit because it looked like that. But then it turned out real, real good. Well, uh, I had Islos uh, apply some pressure to the bandage as I wrapped it around. So, uh, One of mine's good for helped. if not uh, wrapping around uh, bleeding wounds, I suppose. Indeed. A little time passes. You still have like 50 minutes left, Grim, on your treat wounds. You'll be able to do that in shortly. But at this point in time, as you guys have spent as much time as you could treating wounds and whatnot, you guys see a secret passageway that Cass pointed out earlier and then the normal passageway mm-hmm. here. What do you guys do? The secret uh, room. Yeah, when in doubt, the secret yes. room, right? Hold, yeah. hold on, hold on. If well, we look, uh, stand over here real quick. Oh. Uh, well, you see there's light over there. No. And from- <laughs> See, well, I didn't see. The, I definitely did not see anything. <laughs> but there's light coming there and from the yeah. tunnel, so I think they Wait, lead to the same place. Yeah. But that was some guy. No, there was I... nothing there. I don't know what you're talking about. Everyone oh, no, like looks over and sees. There's a lot of fungi. Yeah. <laughs> Can I recall knowledge? Probably a nature check. I shall. Public. The mm. fake cuffing is not good for my throat. Public, public. Okay, that's fine. Aye. They're fungi, Anovan. They are fungi. They are indeed fungi. I knew it. 
Now, north of us in the spine of the world, they said they had this thing up there called reindeer mushrooms, but I was never sure if they called them that because you ate them, because the reindeer ate them, or because you ate them and you thought you were a reindeer. Reindeer. <laughs> no, it's because uh, when you eat them, you think it's actually raining deer. Oh, now that would be bad. That, no, it is quite. It's a lot of dodging. What do, <laughs> what do you think of deer compared to horses? <laughs> Oh, deer are great, particularly reindeer. You know, they're honorable and majestic. And, Didn't you, know, you ride one? I did, I did. Yeah, and he was real Your nice. Your friend was. <laughs> you notice how he talked to us the whole time while the horse didn't, horses didn't do nothing but bark yeah, the, the whole time? The night. horses weren't awakened, tell me. Horses were stupid. You know, had they been awakened, they still would have been dumb, is my guess. Uh, Jardin, why is it only that you and I got a headache and nobody else? I... Something's not working out. It's here. just our intellect. I don't know. Different. Don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe that trap there, was know. geared more towards people who would be seeking to steal knowledge from these folks, and you know that would require oh. a higher, I mean, a higher I aptitude for learning. And I'm pretty sure it only attacked the people who had two legs and pointed ears. Yeah. It attacked me. Uh, oh, so they're, they're just racist head. statues. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. Wait, but uh, Cash, you've got pretty pointy ears. Wait, actually, do you have ears? Oh, that's just a hole. I don't, I don't think Cass yeah. has. Where are your ears? Well, that's rude to ask this man. Yeah, that's just kind of rude, man. You know? I got, <laughs> oh, I got sorry. Them. I got them and they work. <laughs> they're hidden, they're private. Yeah, they're mine. <laughs> <laughs> My ears. You can meet them. <laughs> Yeah, let's get it here, but thank you. Right, well, uh, <laughs> did you did you hear the secret passage or did you see it? Like, oh, you you would like to know that, wouldn't you? I, I would. That's why I'm asking, actually. Yes. Yeah, but that's a secret. Oh, they warned me about this. If you go on a multi-species raid, sometimes you have to work out the uh, funnier bits in conversation. Oh, Pablo. Yes. I think you forgot something. Did I? To record. No, I'm recording. Why? Oh, I don't know. I, normally, you're always announcing it beforehand when you're recording. I didn't. Did record. he? Did, did he? Yeah. yeah oh, sorry, thank, that's my bad. thank goodness. So yeah, I just yeah. freaked out for a second. Yeah. I was like, oh my god. Yeah. Like, Can you cut that out? I, I, Can you I, cut I, that I, out, Pablo? Now I look yeah. like a nerd. <laughs> I, uh, is there any reason in particular that you're panic. still on the ground? Uh, I I just. <laughs> I like I like the bones down here. I'm just trying to get some bone meal. Can I collect some bone meal actually whilst I'm, whilst I'm here? Do you think? I'll stare at Onovan. <laughs> but it's really good for plants. I'll, I'll I'll give him some of the bones in my bag. <laughs> it's true. Oh. You can't grow much up where I'm from, but the gardeners did use to plant the bones of their enemies there. No. You know, we did this oh, trick back home where that. we put four spruce saplings in a in a side by side. And then we just went around bone wheeling them over and over again. And all of a sudden, a wow, tree would just pop wow. out. <laughs> wow, I love that one. Is that how Islos was born? Uh, I was trying it, you know, but it uh, didn't quite work out in the same way. But th then the gate happened, so... You know, maybe the gates are full of bone meal. Maybe that's what they're, they're a gate to. Oh, that just an endless too. supply of fertilizer. Back in the uh, in the forest where Jardin found, Why you're there, were, uh, <laughs> there were trees, and when you uh, when you cut them down, sometimes they would float in midair. When Wait, you what? cut them down the middle, yeah, yeah, that was very no. very very weird. Yeah. What? Yes. Now, would Same you think they like, like, did that, or trees that dirt. acted normal, except when you cut them down, they screamed? Oh well, I mean. Never heard that one before. Not even in Minecraft, so. Cass, up Gosh. ahead, you see what seems to be a shield on the wall that is glowing. Oh, if there's a cool new shield, oh. I want that. Cass has yes. heard something. Yeah, it's a cool shield. Oh. oh, no. Cass, as you move forward non stealthily, you notice three of these fungus fleshies biding their time. Why can't there be anything friendly in here? No, however, that's, not be friendly. that's friendly. However, a friendly as they eyes. hiss something out in Sylvan. Oh, do I speak Sylvan? I think I do. I do speak Sylvan. Jordan also speaks. I don't. Hey, I speak. Uh, 
Necro, I think. You guys read that? Yeah. Heard that? Can whoever speaks Selden yeah. can read yep. that? What? Oh, shit. What do you? I could have maybe talked to the skeletons. Oh, we're, we're will... in their grove. D yeah. Don't step on their mushrooms. I'm not stepping on their mushrooms. I'm just gonna. Oh, that's the but... shield was kind of cool. Tell me, why do you speak? What the Cass? You absolutely see there's no mushrooms on this area. You could theoretically grab those, the shield. They're just yeah. kind of... Yeah, 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 don't worry. I'm just, I'm just, uh, I just want a shield and I'll, I'll be right out of your hair. Yeah, we, we should go talk oh, to them. The plants, is it more? Uh, Onovan and Isla are going to try and move up. So I assume, Pablo, I can't stand here. They just, as a second you step slightly closer, they will just... Oh, yeah, let's go, let's go. There's no other way Friendly. over here. Onovan, how yeah. how do I make bone meal? Don't go this way. They don't, oh, they're, they're angry. It takes a while. Uh, we'll do that later. Oh, yeah. okay. Uh, uh, but the I way figured maybe they'll be friendly that way. if we give them something to eat. On the on the right side, so we should uh, we should go there. Wait, wait, let way. me let me chat with them first. It's okay. They're just plant right. people. It's like my thing. It's like yeah, my but, entire yeah, they, character. They, they, it's yeah, like my like whole kissing archetype. At me. <laughs> they're, they're like kissing at me. They're kind of scary. It's just saying how they think hello. No, I don't think that's hello. They were kind of aggressive. Uh, hello there, uh, mm -hmm. Onovan says in Sylvan. Yeah, stay away from our grove. Oh, shoo, shoo. oh uh, we're just I'm trying to pass through. Uh, my name's Onovan, and, and this is Islos. Uh, we've got some companions here. Um, the, did you like those skeletons down below, or did you want some of the bones for, like, bone meal and stuff? It would help you grow, wouldn't it? What's Do you want some meal? of the bones? What's bone meal? I don't know what that is. You, you talk too uh, much. It's like drugs. Uh, uh, oh, shit. We got some of that. Oh, really? You? How about we trade? We will give you our drugs for your drugs. Even Wait, no, I can't talk to these guys. You cannot, <laughs> no. Sorry, go ahead, on. Never mind. I'm not going to propose drugs. Uh, we, to can, we can give you the bones, maybe, and then, you know, you... Uh... You help us out. Make sure, um, you know, we, let us pass through. We won't step on anything, and, and we can just go through uh, the area um, that we saw the other way and, and try and sidestep around your territory. Want me to promise you? Won't step on anything. Cass is, like, urgently trying to tell you something, but... Um... Yep. Just uh, way to the right, I will say. Ah, oh, I'm gonna... Hey, yes. Come on, Oliver. Be nah. less shit. I mean, that's less shit. Let's nah. go away. Yeah. You know, step on mushrooms. You know, touch us. You're fine. You step on mushrooms. Okay. You die. Okay. Let's let's go that other way then, and just don't step on any mushrooms. Yep, I mean, there's the mushrooms man. in the way here, so Jump. just don't step on them. Okay. Jump over them. Hello, friends. Wait. Coming through. Oh. Wait until we're there, though. You know, because. If they attack you. Yeah. Hello, well, yes. friend. Nice guy, um, yeah, I agree. Can I give them the uh, the oak leaf mask? Maybe they like that. Yeah, I, I wouldn't friends. try and give them anything. They're um, they're not exactly the most agreeable. Does fungi like water? Onovan, you should know this. Plant lore? <laughs> oh, wait. I can get us over without uh, touching any of the fungus if you want, folks. Sure, I mean, I'm scared because the tile in front of me you that I have to pass could, through has one. You guys can literally just leap one square. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, yeah, I'll yeah, do yeah. That's yeah. I was thinking. You're good. Uh, Reaper's flying, so she can just go yeah. like that. Right. You guys can actually draw, click and drag and press Alt on your keyboard to teleport. Alt on your oh, keyboard. Yeah. Theoretically. I do control and then I do space with mine. I can control dragon. Oh, if you like, but like, look at Helmy right now, guys. Yeah. Whoop, she teleported. <gasps> Whoop, she teleported. When I press alt, it opens up something in my browser. <laughs> oh, okay. So alt and drag. Oh, I do. Cool. So you, you can rebind the on Foundry. I'll do that later. Nice. All right. Um, yeah. yeah. What do you guys do? Uh, we're avoiding online warriors where you sell my companions. Will keep... Okay, sorry. Uh, I shouldn't read that as a lot, but um, roll me intimidation. Roll me. I will hear avoid that. You should probably do that. Oh, dear. 
Hiss, hiss, hiss. Fuck off. Fuck <laughs> you. <laughs> oh, you walked through the next room. Great. Aw, they're so fucking ugly. Mm. Bum, 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 bum. I like the music, though, yeah. You this session's see... been too much fun. It's, it's worrying me. You will see... There's a lot of letters. Two of these things. Let me show you the picture. Hello. I, I, I imagine they're oh. dancing to the music. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Are they toilet people? seats? Oh, no, it's a tail. Okay. New people. Oh, oh, welcome. <laughs> it's a welcome seat. to Hello. the memory cache. Oh, yes. Uh, what's your name, please? Uh, Grim. Grimeth. Pulls out a script paper. <laughs> Occupation? Uh... Uh, fighter. Okay. Uh, would you be so kind as to tell me your entire backstory? Oh, oh. oh new person. Hello. Hello there. What's your name? Oh, hello. You're oh, for I'm uh, Onovan Miffinbib. Appointment for the, uh, the, um, the memory cache? Yes? Yes. Oh, yes. I'm, I'm here to talk about it. I'm, I'm a gardener. Okay. Um, Could you spell your name, please? Ono, Ono, uh, Onovan, just... uh, O, uh, N, O V A N M Y F. Sorry, Y. Uh, yes. Y, y F F. Okay, yeah. Uh -huh. F uh, E N B I P. E E E for yeah, echo. Yeah, one more time. E for banana. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Echo, okay. Uh, Niagara, bacon, uh, indigo, uh, poltergeist. Excellent. <laughs> Run it down. Excuse me. You want to know my backstory? Oh yes, please. Your uh, your reason for being here. Um, oh, uh, like that. Um, we wish to speak to. Shit, what was his mother called? Mm -hmm, we didn't mm -hmm, never get a mm -hmm, name. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm not asking oh, you. Sorry. There's more people. Uh, please wait in line for the. Um... Okay. Do I go first? No, no. Uh, the rest of the people. Please wait in line. This might take a moment. Um. Okay. So. Uh, I'm gonna address one of them real quick, and then I'll address Jar uh, Grim. Grim will be you'll, you'll be asked about um, the qualities of how bones work and why they're full of calcium. Onovan, you will be asked about gardening. You've got some plants in your hair. Tell me everything you know about gardening. Wow, uh, this is so weird. Why are they asking me about bones? Don't even know so much. There's about a lot those. in your backpack. You must know a lot about them. That's fair. Yeah, I uh, I was I have a bone collection. I hear them rattling. Anyway, please tell me about the properties of bones. What are they made of? Uh, bone. Bone. Okay. Hmm. And yeah. uh, bone marrow. And uh, well, if you drink a lot of milk, your bones will get stronger. Anybody proficient in society? That is not oh. Anno or Grim. Believe it or not. Uh, yes. Okay. Oh my. Help me. Help me. Do you make your way forward <laughs> I am slightly? As well. And I see what's going on. Well. Okay. Hell me, since you're next in line, roll me a secret society check and roll me a secret <gasps> perception check. I might. Let me, uh, let me set it up for your secret. Uh, blind GM roll. Uh, here is the society first. Perfect. And Tell me, where in the world have you experienced bureaucracy? Uh, well, her mom was the... Uh, head of the church of Desna over at their village. So she's probably experienced a lot of religious bureaucracy. Mm -hmm. This is bureau this is bureaucracy at its finest. Romy see your perception check. Okay. Mm. So um what what are you guys called? That is a sense motive. You get a feeling that these creatures, whatever they are, are gonna ask an incessant, never ending stream of questions probably take an hour per person and then move on before ever letting you through so i'm jarves but it's not about me it's about you tell me okay, I will keep where are you safe. from what planet if you're not from this planet um galaria okay 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 and then onovan you are asked about gardens please tell me everything you know oh well uh, actually i'm i'm uh, trying to get to the best in bloom still um it's been a, a long journey so far your um, your boss. What was their name again? Hmm? Oh yeah, our boss, our boss. Yeah, what about him? Marquesh, was it? Marquesh. I know you said their name. C could you spell it out for me? I just wanted to 
Like you, I spelled out, you know, mine. Can you spell out your boss's name? Are you trying to speak to the manager right now? Roll me a diplomacy check, please. Yeah. Roll me a speak to the manager check. <laughs> this is, this is my current roll. roll. Yeah. Ah. Uh, Our boss will uh, help me out. The cow Would you like my was... last hero points, Anava? Yes. I will. Can I do that? that? Oh, let me roll. Come on. Ooh! Ooh. They'll start let getting nervous. Let me speak nervous. to your manager. Uh, that's a, let me speak to your manager for sure. Roll. Um, they'll start getting nervous. It's like, I'm, I'm, our boss is kind of not available. Yeah, he's on a business trip, too. Well, that's too bad. I'm sorry, but uh, uh, head management will be very mad. You know, with his orders come, we've t I've brought a lot of bones, as you can see here. And I'm really hoping to speak to uh, your, your boss friend. Help me, am I doing it right? You're doing great. Uh Make sure and bring up the fact that uh, middle management is going to get cut. Uh, middle management is going to no. get cut if this no. continues on. No! Our promotions. Yeah, this is actually... Our commissions. Uh, this, you know, you, you were told that an audit could happen at any moment, so, I mean, you really should Listen, sort this out. We need to center... Oh, let me find... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on. You haven't been completing your daily stand-ups. Hold on. Yeah. And your scrum <laughs> meetings. Hold Where's on. Oh, my here as Lord. Well? Don't. Hold on. I got, I got it. I got I, it. I have to I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Center... We need to synergize a little bit. Um, and we need to use our leverage... Uh, uh, I'm just the best practices right now. I'm just making up oh, straight up. You should just... unionize. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry, Kat. We need to be more agile. Core you know? competency, <laughs> core agile, competency yeah. and yeah. scalability. Don't forget the value proposition. Don't uh -oh. forget to do the retrospective. Oh my god. Vertical integration and key performance indicators <laughs> are the key. Uh, they're just talking to each other at this point. Uh, okay. Helm is just gonna move past. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Fine. <laughs> this uh, roll me secret perception, Cass, if you're in the room. All right, help me. What's Jordan. behind this could be our worst. I'm just going to stand over here. So, and talk to a bit we more. Open it at the same oh, end. oh! Uh, tell me more about gardening, or you know, whatever your passion yes. is. Well, uh, can I try and like pick up these papers as I'm talking right. to them, and just? Help me with a green open them. it at the same time as Grim. Okay. Uh, you green. try to pick up these papers there just... um. Let me double check, actually. What do we got? Uh, well, roll me a secret perception as well, Anaman, as you're doing this. Um, oh, my. They are... Um, uh, these papers have... Uh, f just random information. Okay. There's literally random information from, like... Uh, they they seem to be knowledge collectors and collecting all the knowledge they can. You do find some scrolls though, but they're like you know part of its loot, so you have to convince them or steal it off of them or some shit. Oh, Ooh. whoa, that's oh. tricky. Oh, you guys open the door. Well, let's change the music to something more creepy. Oh fuck. Where's my paranormal creepy music? Wait a minute, this isn't the memory room. Oopsie, close the Wait. door. <laughs> Exoskeletons of ghosts. These are proper aliens. I you mean, see they look proper like, uh... aliens. They stand silently staring at you all. I'm going to wait till Anaman's done with whatever he's doing before continuing. I think we scene. found the manager. I mean, that's perfect timing. I don't mind. Okay. As you enter, as you see these Calborns, you will see the Grove of Memory. <gasps> ornate Trees. lanterns stand from the stalactites along the ceiling of this vast, dimly lit cavern. An orchard of short, leafless trees spread out across the floor, their twisted branches weighed down with shadowed shapes of odd fruit. Three emaciated and hairless things with their arms folded into the sleeve of silver robes stand before the grove. The figure in the uh, front will raise a long figured hand, and telepathic words ripple through the air and through your mind as they say, Welcome, scholars. Um, I'm not a scholar, but thank you. Um, oh, we I'm are just going here... to get my shield. <laughs> we are here to uh, review the memory. Can I recall knowledge or something to see what your name was? Yeah, you know what you know where it is. It's um, God, I don't even know. Hold on, Sa Iscariel, <laughs> Iscariel, yeah, Iscariel. Yeah, for Iscariel, we are looking for her memory. 
Um, mm -hmm. At this point in time, I need a will save, Grim. I will, will save. Are these Edit. two looking away? No, they're looking straight at you. You need a thievery or a deception check. That is a failure. You feel your mind being rifled through. I hate this. Uh... Interesting. Yeah, we seek the knowledge you desire. The grove contains these memories. But what memories will you offer in return? Uh, I mean, if I had a hold of my own, I would give you them, but... And I'm gonna sort of... <sighs> um, wh what are you looking for specifically? I would like a specific instance of a memory, whether recent or back in the day that you consider appropriate to share and have removed. In return- I will not remember it anymore. You will not remember it anymore. Shit, that's there really is, good. There is a mechanical benefit or a mechanical switch to this as well. Do you want to know now or do you want to know later? Uh, can I think about it for a second? Because there's so many memories. Everyone has. must do this if you want to pass. Everyone? Uh, I don't know, guys. I but Does that I include have... your workers here? They are not affiliated with us. No, no, no. One moment, one moment, one moment. Uh, uh, uh. Run! Union, run! Right? And they'll start just running. I'm going to loot <laughs> as they run away. Yeah. Well, do you mind if I sit down? So if I'm going to tell a story, I can do it in my people's fashion. You shall not remember it afterwards. But yes, feel free to divulge it. So mechanically, guys, let me give you a thing. Um, this is a memory exchange. Essentially, you can... I want to explain this in, in like out-of-game terms so you guys uh, just get, get a sense of this. You can... It's got to be a good story from either your backstory or something in this adventure that your character will no longer remember anymore. They will judge the value and what a good story is. Mechanically, this will give you one advantage. You are allowed, if you want, to change a background feed. As in, for example, Helmy has Intimidating Glare as a skill feat. You can change that around to anything you want. That's a level one skill feat. Okay. If you want, if you want... If you don't want to, it's going to rearrange your memories a little bit. I would urge you to give me a backstory story so it makes more sense in terms of um, in terms of like removing. But it's not strictly required. Your memories are going to be fuzzled, fuzzled anyway. So with that being said and done, who's first? I will um, go. And uh, I'll take a step forward. Do I DM you which memory it is? You certainly can if you want to just think it and they'll just siphon your memory off. So it's up to you. I'll DM you. you just so you know which one it is. That's fine. You guys can DM or explain to the party as a story if you want to do that. All right. So in terms of Joyce... Uh, Joyce, in Joyce's case, he is going to just think and then let me see what it is and then I'll see if it's acceptable or not. In the meantime, while he does that, Helmy, do you want to tell your story? Oh, okay, I see. Yeah? Acceptable. Wait, wait, I, I have an idea, guys. Uh, can I confer with my companions for, for a second before we do this? We are here. All right. Um, guys, what if we tell these memories to one another beforehand, and then we can distribute them back afterwards? Well, that was what I was going to do. I was just going to go in there and tell it in front of everybody. And then, yeah. Um, well, I don't know if my one is the thing I want to say, but... I don't mind. I, I was actually going to use this as a bit of a hack to live much longer. Um, you see, gnomes, if they don't have new experiences, they die. So I was just going to like tell them all of my most boring, mundane experiences uh, that I can remember and just get rid of all those. And then I can just experience them again and I'll live for a few more years, I suppose. 
wouldn't it be smarter to give them your uh, like a fun memory so you could just do it again rather than you look we had to deal with the racist statues okay you don't question my <laughs> intellect yes sir <laughs> <laughs> Hero point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I mean, I, I could, I could, but I, I like the fun ones. I mean, uh, I don't know. Uh, how about the things that I, I wouldn't mind experiencing for the first time again and the boring ones? Well, or do we get to give them more than one? Yo, can I give you more than one? We will take as many as you offer. But one person each must do at least one memory. Okay. Do I get any benefits for giving you more than one? You will lose them forever in your mind. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> in the law, this is correct, yeah? Like, yeah. This makes sense. I like it. I like it. I actually, that's why I gave you the hero point, not the jab, but it was, the, it was a great sweet. idea, yeah. Um,. All right, so do I, I do I just tell you guys? Sure, if you're comfortable with it. I mean, not really, but do I have much choice? Well, you could always whisper it into their, well, I want to say ears, but I'm not sure they have. You it. could just think it and they can just, just drain it off your mind. If that, if you're like, but again, I will forget it if I do that. For well, you could tell, uh, you could tell Trucker is lost if you don't trust any of us. Although Islos will tell me, so I suppose that's a bit of a cheap one. I, I'm not a gossip. I, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> or you could tell me, Grim, because we've been together the longest. Wow, guys, you're really going to make me make that choice. <laughs> yeah, pick your favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I mean, you guys are all so awful. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm kidding, kidding. Um, I mean, you have known Jordan for a long time, eh? I even thought you two were together for the longest time, so... I mean, maybe Jordan already knows it. Jordan, Jordan, come with me. Okay. Uh, is there a private room here? Oh, uh, you can just move back some... Like, yeah, back here is fine. Um, okay. And you can I... PM it. You can PM it to him while, if you want, yeah. or something. Well, yeah. while, yeah. While, while you do that, I will have Helmy do me a favor and tell their memory. Okay. So oh, this one will be good. It's probably pretty common knowledge at this point that I didn't. But fit it's in about a well butt. My village. That you didn't want, oh. sorry? Didn't fit in that well in my village, right? You know, even before I started profit, sprouting, you know, feathers and extra eyes, uh, I wanted to be both a lady and a fighter. And there are parts of the Linorm Kingdom where that's fine, but my village, not so much. Now, my dad, he wasn't no great warrior, right? He was unusually focused on gardening, farming, that sort of thing, which tends to be women's work, but he was real good at it, and he liked it. And uh, he couldn't run so good, so he never really got to go out fighting. But generally speaking, when you wanted to go out raiding in my village for your first raid, you'd go out with either your older brother or your pa. Now, I ain't got no brothers, but I really wanted to go. So one night, I begged my pa to go out on a raid with me. Even though I knew he didn't like it that much and wasn't any good at it, he said I was his daughter and he'd do it for me. So I took him out on his horse in the middle of the night. And we went out to go rustle up some of the other island across the strait from us cattle, right? Because cattle thieving is real, real proper, honest work where we come from. And we mostly get away from it, but we're doing it at night. And while we're doing it, his horse trips and lands on him. So that's my secret. I killed my dad. Oh. And that's why I don't like horses none. Whoa. That's why I don't uh, like myself yeah. that much neither. And as oh. you tell that story, Helmy, it is completely removed from your mind. Oh. As the Calborn will say, acceptable memory definitely has its emotions attached to it. You may pass. Neat. What I pass. <laughs> I may... get it. Oh, okay. Arrow point. 
you you can you can pass. You can also remove if you want. Remove a skill feat if not, or change the skill feat background skill feat if not. That's fine. You just fit, let me know if you'd like to do that. I uh, I pulled like it to Jarden. There's a lingering horse racism yep. in here, even if she doesn't remember why. <laughs> <laughs> Next. Uh, I suppose uh, I should go. No. I'll go. Oh, well, you can telepath it to them. I think that's the right verb. Is that yeah, the right uh, verb, guys? I think it's really hard. <laughs> but, Jordan, you got to tell me again after, because I want to keep this one. Can you give okay. me the name, if you don't mind? Just so I can yes. double check. Uh, well, he's not in the uh, in my doc, I don't think. Is he not in your they... doc, either way? Well, okay. he's mentioned in the original one, but I I haven't... I haven't given him a name I yet, see, so, uh, I see. It's in the original one. Name. Okay. That's the, really... The, yeah, why yeah. you call him Pablo? Silly. I'm no, kidding. that was the old one. No, no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> really, really far-fetched. Uh, these trees don't look anything like the ones we saw in Kinepo's no. realm, do they? No, okay, no. cool, 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 cool. cool. I'll, I'll be thinking that, Pablo, as I'm standing I need to figure out where in your original backstory this is, just so I can, for my own. Want me to highlight it for you? Yeah, that'd be great. Uh, in the original doc, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can do that. Oh, I see. I see it. I see it now. I see it now. I see it. 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 Are you sure? Are you sure? I this don't want you to have the wrong Right one. here? Right here? If you send a screenshot. Okay, it's the last. You know that the where you are, that paragraph, that last paragraph, that last sentence of the paragraph. Wait here. No, <laughs> I'll try. Up, 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 <laughs> up, one. up. One more. Here. That paragraph, the last sentence. Yes. Yes. Okay. okay. That's perfect. Acceptable. You shall not remember this anymore. Move on. Next, please. Jardin will go, will step forward. Oh, Jardin. And he will regale this loud enough for everybody to hear. Mm -hmm. So, when I was taken to the Mages Academy, uh, as a half-elf, I was somewhat of an outcast. Um, but there was one individual who treated me like absolute dog crap. His name was Rand Hartlett, and we had a professional, yet yeah, unprofessional rivalry with each, with each other. And uh, at one point in time, I set up a little trap for him. But in so doing, when the trap was thrown, he was under evaluation and embarrassed him to the point where they demoted him uh, to a lower rank. And um, no one ever found out that it was actually me that, that caused him to be dem uh, demoted, though he has his suspicions, I think. And I'm just waiting for my come my come up and to come back to bite me in the in the backhand. You had an achievement in a way that is now ours. Acceptable. Move along. This was quite a juicy one. Definitely. Next. Go and then Cass. Uh, right. If you know, if you want to see if the. The best to second last? That'll be no problem. Um, yeah, you know, uh, you know, I, uh, you know, I left my tribe, uh, you know, to explore the the world. But you know, I, I wasn't always like that. You know, once I just, you know, I wanted to stay and you know live with my tribe. But uh, uh, once I was uh, on a a night patrol. Uh, keeping watch over the tribe, uh, as you know, as one does. I uh, I fell asleep, and uh, and we were we were attacked, uh, which was which means it was my fault. We lost a, f a few good men at my village, and I, I, I could never look anyone in the eye at the village 
since then. And it's uh, it's the reason I've been uh, been traveling to you know find a way, find a new place to be, and you know uh, do better. Your failure and memories and regret is now ours. Acceptable. Move along. Lastly. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> right, well, there's this one time I was waiting in line, and normally I think I, I'd actually like waiting in line as a person in general, but quite frankly, you know, this time really ruined it for me. It was cold outside, and we were waiting for just some porridge, and it was, you know, the war times, so the porridge wasn't even that good, and it was like about hours that I was this waiting there, and ever since then I've hated... an acceptable memory. Oh, I'm going to give you lots, though. Maybe it's qu quantity over quality, so don't worry. Uh, the next time, I had a mail come through my door, and I was so excited for that. But it just ended up being about a shop down the road. It was th some, like, junk mail or something. I normally really like mail, but, uh, you know, ever since then, I've been a bit suspicious of it. Not an acceptable memory. Uh, I also had to uh, listen to a politician talk at length for once. I, I really think I'd quite like that experience back again, or, or just at least, you know... Um, maybe the opportunity to listen to a different politician and one not so uh, intent on fascist um, regimes Roll and stuff. Roll me diplomacy, <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I mean, these are all like fizz and, uh, you know, zest for life. I, oh, come on, that was an 18 every time! You do have a hero <laughs> point, yeah. Oh, I do, yeah, I'll reroll that. Natural one incoming. Fail, fail, uh, fail. Can I? I'm gonna guidance myself I as I speak. Idea. Is that is that allowed? It's not gonna help you much. Like just just do it. I, I yeah, it would be more than a, a one action thing. I think to be honest with you. But fair enough. Oh, what you're gonna do now is spend ten minutes talking, essentially. Okay. And talking. <laughs> That's fine. And talking. And at this I point, an idea. they are starting to get silent and just listening. After a I, bit. I, I, yeah. I have 50 more options that I can go through, so just let me know, you know, whatever you need. It's fine. <laughs> oh, then I um, may have an alternative should this not work. No. Oh, no, I think I'm getting there. After you tell 50 stories, the other party <laughs> members are just, you can treat wounds if you want, Grim, to be honest with you. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the called born will say, all your boring memories as a cumulative have been accepted. <gasps> yes. <laughs> as you feel all these boring memories running away from your mind, Donovan, you, oh, feel, you feel strange because, feel. because what you used to consider exciting is now a little bit more boring. What you no, that's really horrible. exciting is now just exciting. As you don't have the lowest of the lows to compare oh. exciting moments with. Oh. Am I making sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've given me depression. Got it. <laughs> 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 He's got to get a hero point for that one. <laughs> too close to home. <laughs> As you don't have any boring memories to compare your exciting events to. The most exciting, the least exciting event to you, which could have been on a roller coaster, just whatever, whatever mm -hmm. it is, is now just a more mundane event. Still exciting, but more mundane. Got you. So you can role play that accordingly. But I think yeah. we, um, as you're all accepted, and as you think about if you want to change a background feat, that's up to you guys if you want to do that. Not required, but it, it is allowed to re retrain for free. Uh, do we want to? I think we should call it. Is it a session time? Yeah. Before we head to, yeah. before we head to the grove good. of memories for your intense, basically um plot, plot heavy stuff. So, uh, thank you guys for watching, YouTube, yay! And